بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Hello everyone and welcome to this is football It had to be It had to be Episode 69 of Al-Ahwa And we're here uh, And Liverpool have lost um, Spurs have lost Chelsea have won And City have won This is the summary this week You know And uh, we have to introduce the panel And we have to get the show started uh, big up to every single one of you guys watching us right now. Uh, make sure you guys are hitting the like button. Make sure you guys are subscribing to This Is Football if you're ready to do so. I know you're all here for the Liverpool downfall. There's 500 people in here already. The minimum I want from all of you guys is 500 likes. Hit the like button right now. I don't want to keep saying it because you know I'm about to get cooked. So imagine I stop Hamza in the middle of his monologue about 1973. Um, you know, and I just tell you guys to like the video. You guys don't like that, right? So make sure you guys are liking the video right now and subscribing. And uh, yeah, uh, let me introduce today's panelists. You get to be. Uh... This guy's team, you know, um, beat Newcastle by two goals to nil. I think he's even happier today. Um, he's even probably happier today than the Man United rep that we have, which is crazy. He has smile, has been breaking his face. I have never seen him this happy for the last three years. This is the happiest he's ever been today. Inshallah, always happy, but not from a football perspective, Hamza. Joining us on the channel is the top chef, the master chef, the guy that's about to give us a speech about how the Champions League that Liverpool won in 1977 was fraudulent. Man like Hamza is interesting. How are you doing, Hamza? Brother? <clears throat> yeah, I'm doing well, guys. I'm doing well. Yeah, we're about to eat today. It's cake, and I got myself a glass of milk. Yeah, cold glass of milk. But I said one thing: I don't want to miss this show. So I got the milk out the fridge. I said, "Yo, I'm not going to the fridge to get the milk. The milk stays here." <laughs> The mook is going to stay with me here tonight. Ha, you ain't going to leave. Hey, I'm going to drink it tonight. <laughs> We're going to drink that milk tonight with cake, guys. Get ready, guys. Get ready. We're eating good. <laughs> Woo. Big up, Hamza. Can you tell them to like and subscribe, Hamza, so maybe they will listen to you? Like and subscribe, guys. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Today, make sure you are here, guys. Make sure if you don't live for fun, we're together today. We're united, bro. I want to give you guys a hug. Come on, let's go. Bring the show on, man. Bring the guys Oh, on. Lord. Okay. Okay. Joining us on the channel next is the guy that delivered me the defeat today. Uh, you know, Manchester United obviously beating Liverpool. Uh, all his favorite footballers scored. Rashford. Um, you know, Anthony, um, who else scored? McTominay, you know, so all his favorite ballers scored goals today to, to, to defeat us in the FA Cup. So joining us on the channel, the United fan, well, I, I don't even think a hug will help me right now, FK. Um, man like Staffy is in the building. Hello, Staffy. Obviously, shamelessly keeping the OBS score up. You are the biggest fraud in the planet, but okay. I just had to add a little bit more. Um, first of all, Hamza, hide the, the cake and the milk away from me because I'm still fasting. But I'm not that hungry, Hamza. You know why? Because today I broke my fast. I'm not going to lie, guys. I have to hold my hands up. Unfortunately, today I broke my fast. Because I absolutely munched Liverpool today. Hamza, they came to me. They came to my ground. And I was like, you know what? I'm fasting. But I got to feast on these guys. I said, yo, come here. I don't care about Ramadan. I'll make this day up later. I absolutely destroyed them, Hamza. I ate them alive, Hamza. I ate them alive in Old mm. Trafford, Hamza. And you know what, Hamza? There's uncomfortable conversations that are going to be had today. Yep. Because when I sat here and I told them about my footballer, could be my new, 18 years old, 18 years old Hamza. Mm. And they told mm. me, quote unquote, they told me, I don't give a fuck about a footballer who's played 12 games. <laughs> they pay 100 million for him, Hamza. Mm. I'm not Chelsea. I don't pay 100 million for youngsters. No, you don't. I get them from my academy. Yeah. Then they boss them on the pitch today. I'm yep. at Diallo. 
I didn't pay 100 million for him. I got him for what 30 million from Syria a few years ago. You know, yeah. Syria, Hamza, you always talk about the Syria. Yeah. It's it's always team. be a great league. Great mm-hmm. league always has great talent. Comes mm-hmm. on today. And who rated him? I always rated him. The ballers that I rate, it's not a coincidence, Hamza. Mm-hmm. The players that I rate <laughs> end up delivering me to win. You know what, yep. Hamza? I found I found out a crazy stat today. Wallahi, you're gonna laugh about this, Hamza. Don't drink your milk now because you might spit the milk laughing. Apparently, these guys, Hamza. I've had zero wins this year against the traditional top six. Hey! Allah, I didn't even know that. Allah, I didn't even know that. <laughs> I'm sorry, I played them twice to see. I'm, sorry, I'm, a, I'm, sorry, I'm a joke. I'm a joke. My team is a joke, Hamza. Mm-hmm. And I played them twice this year. Wallahi, they couldn't beat me. Wallahi, they couldn't beat me, Hamza. And I'm a joke. I'm having a joke season. Imagine I believe that, Hamza. It. And you know what they told me, Hamza? Mm-hmm. They told me quad season. They told me his farewell tour. Club, club mm-hmm. has to go back on a farewell tour. Yeah, and you know what? Ten Hag, I spoke to Ten Hag. I spoke to him mm-hmm. yesterday. Hamza I called him. Mm-hmm. I called him after iftar. I called him. I said Ramadan Karim. He said Ramadan Karim. Stuffy. By the little convo about the tactics tomorrow. I said, mm-hmm. but yo, are you not scared about the motivation for club? You know mm-hmm. what he told me, Hamza. He told me Eras come to an end. He told mm-hmm. me that. He was like, remember I said that stuff. I said, yeah. yeah. That's all I need to know. Come I said, Khalas, I said, you know what, tonight? Hang up the phone right now. I said, I don't need to hear no more. Mm-hmm. Come tonight, I'll see you tomorrow. Mm-hmm. And today, you know what he did, Hamza? He ended one of their four, their four ch- trophy hopes this season. Yep. She- history will remember this, Hamza. History will always remember that club on his final season. Yep. When they had the farewell tour. Yep. They wanted the quad. Who's yep. the first manager to end one of his hopes? Not Pep. Not Arteta. Nope. Not Poch, not Real Madrid. Not, not, no one. No, no one big. Real Madrid. Ten Hag. Ten mm-hmm. Hag. Little Ten Hag that they laugh at, Hamza, mm-hmm. ended their hopes today. Mm-hmm. Now they have to go settle for the three other trophies. Mm-hmm. And remind mm-hmm. me, Hamza, one more thing. In about three weeks, I think, they come back to Old Trafford. Hey! Ten Hag wins again. If he wins again, there goes the Premier League. That's two out of the four. Eras do come to an end, Hamza. Yes. come to an end. Like and subscribe, everyone. Like and subscribe. Today we're cooking. We're eating good. Yep. We're eating good. Seven o'clock, Hamza. I'm about to text you. You pass me that cake. Yeah. I'm that's ready. when I break my fast. I got milk here. Still halfway. <laughs> Still halfway. I'm, 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 I'm coming yeah. with my cup. Too. Okay. The next guy to join us on the panel. His team also won today, beating Leicester by four goals to two. Poch masterclass. You get me. <laughs> they win the game and they're through to the semi-final to face Manchester City. You get me. Uh, the team that, uh, you know, um, Staffy is facing is obviously the easier team. That's the team that we would have got. But they're facing Man City in the semi final. The man, the myth, the legend, no Kiwis spotted today. Man, like Ziyad is in the building. How are you doing, Ziyad? Habibi? Big up, man. Big up to everyone in chat. Big up the panel. Listen, man. Listen, my, my, my youngsters have got Champions League medals, man. So United fans can enjoy their Mainu and Garnacho and Ahmad, Musharraf, Yusmo, Musharraf, Shaw. Uh, my my Champions League young my youngsters have got Champions League medals around their neck, so I think I think that that's settled. But yeah, big up man, look, why is everyone spamming seven 0 Inshallah, my, my United beat uh, Liverpool seven 0 again. I mean Liverpool beat them, but they really won the reverse. They won the reverse one. Alhamdulillah, and Jurgen Klopp. Everyone t- texts me, why do you hate Jurgen Klopp? Did you watch that uh, post match uh, interview? The piece mm. of shit, the salty dickhead, salty. the sore loser. Okay, big up to you guys. Big up. Fuck big up, Zizu. Don't worry, you're all gonna get to cook. This is just the intro, guys. Joining us on the channel as well. His team didn't play this weekend. Um, you know, Man United did to us what Arsenal couldn't. Um, but he's here anyway. You get me. He's top of the league, so he gets his spot. Man like Saad is in the building. How are you doing, Saad? <laughs> hey, Jurgen Klopp quad. Poo. Tottenham winning run. Poo. Hey, listen. Oh, hey, yeah. Hey, huh? Telling me, you're telling me that I get to, I, I get to de- enjoy two delicious dishes. Yeah, two delicious dishes on the iftar. Allah, Allah, Allah. We're prepared for this, man. We're here. We're here. Yeah, we're here to I'm talk glad, about glad. Liverpool. We're here to talk about Spurs. Let's not forget about. Spurs. You know what's going on with your mic? Yeah, your mic is acting up a little. Hold on, hold yeah, on, hold on. Yeah, you need hold to listen on, to yourself on, on YouTube. On. There's hold something on. mad in your mic. 
Okay, now your you full, you whole audio went. You can hear me? Yes, now we can hear you. You can hear me? Yes, perfect. There, there we, we go. go. Perfect. Yeah, listen, don't let's not let Jacob, let's not let Jacob act like he's going to run away. Yeah? Sad, 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 get... sad, 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 sad. Khalas, khalas. We'll, we'll get, we'll get, let me bring out the we'll people. Get yeah. We'll get to him, don't worry, we'll don't worry. Him, we'll but the focus on the main meal, Sad. Yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry. Sad, you want dessert? You want dessert, you want dessert before you eat the main meal? Come on. I'm a big boy. Shout out to, uh, sometimes um, I take books. Like... Shout out to my guy troops as well for the raid. Big up to you guys. Listen, there's already you guys been waiting on this moment, you bozos, eh? There's mm-hmm. already a thousand three hundred people in there. I haven't even finished introducing the panel. I haven't even played the Vel intro, and you guys are just here, just waiting on the downfall. Oh, Arsenal Bunch on the draw, yeah. Oh, Arsenal on the draw as well. Sad troops. Speaking, uh, draw, bro. No, Arsenal not on the draw. Brother, have, have some, draw. have some, have some shame. Have <laughs> some shame, Ziad. He, this guy draw, that just got. This guy, do you know what? It's a it's secondhand embarrassment from you <laughs> because he he lost you lost his kids and uh, Stuffy's kids beat him. So what? Oh, when you finish the tackle. Oh. Anyway, can I talk for fuck's sake? Can I? Can I? Can I, can I, can I fucking talk? I say one thing. Please. Can I say one thing, please? Can I just I wish I, people? Right? I wish I knew what that one thing was. Until today, Speaking I want to know what that one thing is. Speaking of. You get me joining us on the channel is the man that was a loser just last week and just got cooked like two days ago. But today he's going to have his own fun. The judge is here. Man like Judge Mo. How are you doing, Habibi? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Everything is good. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Everything is great. Alhamdulillah. 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 Like and subscribe, people. Like and yes. subscribe. 1,400 people in here. Let's see if Vel done a good job cooking me. Um, and finally, of course, the other loser this week. I'm going to just do this. I'm going to put myself at the bottom. I'm going to remove this. And all we're going to do is going to say hello to Vel's camera. On the left is Anthony Robinson doing as he pleases. Beautiful cross. No! Why is Diaz already on his BS? Yeah, he shoot. Sometimes I don't. There you are. Pelotas perfecta, perfecta, 120 euros, inflada con un barómetro a 8 bares, la cancha no tiene un solo pozo, el arco tiene 7 metros 20 por 2.40, te aplauden cuando salís a la cancha, la concha de tu madre no sabes parar una pelota, le vas a pagar le, al arco y la tirás a la mierda, le vas a hacer un pase a tu compañero que está a un metro y el de así se la pasa mal, hijo de puta eso me puede pasar a mí con esta panza. No, I won't. Oh, good, good, to Shoot! Sam, who's your daddy? Who is your daddy? Fuck! Frankie Munez scores a goal. Fuck! Frankie Munez scores a goal. And they equalize and we mess around again and mess around again and mess around again and we concede. Eight. Has Misa not pushed the balls this year? Oh my god, they gave the ball. But dominates. The Rashford! Fucking Lukic. Who the fuck is Lukic? Hey. Hey. I don't know what the fuck just happened, but it's 3 0. Fuck! Frankie Munez scores a goal. Fuck! Frankie Munez scores a goal. They score and they win the game at the dead. And this is the absolute most pathetic, disgraceful. 
performance of Liverpool Football Club this whole year. So complacent, such an idiotic decision there from Harvey Elliott. And Liverpool are out the cup. Liverpool are out the cup. Let's just say it as it is. Oh, yeah, get home. You've been here for eight years. One Premier League title during COVID. When Boris Johnson loved the country. We told you all we needed a vaccine. But you decided to play football. So you lifted that Premier League in an empty stadium. I think that we remember you as a great. Are you serious? United have beaten us. Man United have beaten us. And we deserve it. And we deserve to lose this game. And we deserve to lose this game. Hmm. Big up, Val. Let me just pour extra milk. Sorry, sir. Big up, Val, for the intro. Big up, Val. You get me? <laughs> Listen, I, listen I, 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 I would go to the Super Chats, but I just feel like we need to let the cooking commence first before we address the Super Chats. Um, so get your Super Chats in. We're going to get them in a separate, like just a specific timestamp where we're going to read them all out and stuff. But uh, yeah, guys, 1,500 people in here. You get me. It's going to be a long day for myself and the fraud above me right here. Um, so, Staffy, the floor is yours. Man United. 4-3, Liverpool. I honestly don't know where to start. Very long game. A lot of events. Seven goals. Um, extra time. You know, a lot of drama. Roller coasters of emotions. Up and down. You know. But I'm not going to hog the mic for too much. I'm not going to try to speak on for too much. Because I want everyone to speak. But what can I say, man? What can I say? One of my worst seasons. I'm coming in with a joke of a team. I'm, 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 my team is a joke. Seriously, my team is a joke. I don't rate my team. I go into games predicting losses. I'd have predicted a loss this game. And listen, we scored early, fair enough. We actually played well in the first half, and then we faded away toward the end. Very, very, very silly end of the first half. I mean, you guys could have been up 3-1 in the first half if it wasn't for the offside goal. He just gave me, like, when Salah scored that goal and it just hit the post and went in, it just looked so easy. It reminded me of that 7-0 because that game, everything was falling luckily to Salah. Like, nothing went wrong that day. And I was like, you know what? This second half is going to be bad. We're going to lose 4-5-1. I was just so angry. I'm like, this team, can you be so slow, play with no intensity, get out-muscled, getting out-possession, getting out-beat in every aspect on the pitch towards the end of the second half, sorry, the first half, when we don't even play midweek football, I was, I, was, I, was, I, was, I, was, I was embarrassed. This team plays in the Europa League. This team plays more football than us. And they looked more fit than us. We're the team that gets more rest. Second half, I don't know what happened. I'm not going to lie. I usually have a lot of tactical analysis when I talk about games. Today, I don't. I actually don't know. I looked at the second half. For some reason, eventually, we ended up having no center backs except Maguire. We had Bruno playing as a quarterback. We had Erickson playing as our six. And we had Maguire playing up front where we're trying to ping the ball to him. To me, that was exactly freestyle football. Today, we won with freestyle football. The manager took a crazy risk, and it worked. Because in the second half, we were shocking. But we managed to pull one late. We made it into extra time. And pretty much, we had all our attackers on the pitch and only one defender on the pitch. So I saw combinations that I've never seen in my life. I saw Anthony playing with Diallo at the same time. Anthony being moved to left back. I saw McTominay play 120 minutes. I saw Garnacho, Pampers boy. That's his new name, Pampers boy, because the guy's a toddler. He's on the he's on the floor more than he's on his feet. He just gets out muscled with everyone. Pampers boy played 120 minutes, you know. And in the second in the second half of the um, of extra time, I don't know what happened. We just peppered you guys. We kept peppering you guys, peppering you guys. And then I don't know. I mean, I feel like I skipped something. Club, what are you doing? Taking off your best players. With 10 minutes left, like you're winning 4-1. The score felt like it was, but it didn't actually read it. Like 2-1, I felt defeated. I felt defeated bad. But the scoreline was so close. 
It only took one bullshit goal from Anthony to bring us back into the game. And by the way, that game should have never went into extra time. That goal should have counted as two. Because not only did Anthony score, he scored with his right foot. I've never seen Anthony pass with his right foot, let alone shoot with his right foot. You know, had Van Dyke doing doing the spinneroonie and kicking the air. I don't know what he was doing. Big big man verge, you know. And in the in the second half, Ahmad Diallo wins it. My baller, you know, comes on. Everyone talks about okay, he plays certain players for pace and pressing and physicality and this like that. This guy was everywhere. He was pressing everywhere. He kept winning the ball. The, the goal that Rashford scored to pull his back three three was because of him because he got the that he pressed Joe Gomez. I think it was. The ball deflected off his foot, went to McTominay, who created the goal, and obviously scored the last one, and deservedly got men of the match, you know? But speaking of men of the match, I had a, a certain 18-year-old on the pitch that I didn't pay 120 mil for, I didn't pay 110 mil for, I didn't buy him for Benfica after playing only six months in Europe, I didn't buy him for Brighton for I don't know how much. You know, I didn't even have to go to West Ham and spend 100 million on him, which rightfully so, because Rice has been worth 100 million. You know, Sad, obviously, me and you can know about elite midfielders this season. I had one that, you know, was mocked, consistently mocked every time I bring it up here. And I was told that no one, what was the quote, Sad? I don't give a fuck about someone who's played only 12 games. 12 games. <laughs> shit, 12 shit. Games. I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. You can meet oh, right no now. fuck, fuck is too strong, man. Fuck, fuck is too strong. Meet yourself. No, I, I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit. No, no one's talking to you. Meet yourself. No, no, you're, you're saying something I said, so I don't give sit a shit. Sit on the floor. Sit on the floor. Sit on the floor. I don't right sit now. on the floor. We won as well. I'm the at the top. Right the big boys. No, are talking. yeah, big boys. We're both the big at the top. We're both in the semi-final. Right. So, so you're ruining I'll my see you floor. in the final. No one wants to listen to you right now. Yeah, I would love to see you in the final. That's an easy dub right there. That's an easy dub right there. That's an easy dub. Relax, bro. Clip it. Relax. Relax, relax. We'll talk about that later. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about your almighty win today later. Who'd you play a bit face again? You look you look like a, a championship side along next to um what's the name? Lester. So that's your level. Probably, so yeah. right, we'll talk about that later. Anyways, a certain 18-year-old that they laughed about every time I mentioned him, and he completely bossed the midfield today. He gave me flashbacks of Pogba when he was dribbling through these players. And I said this before. I said, listen, rarely does does uh Lightning strike twice in the same spot. And we messed up with Pogba years ago. And God just gave us another chance with another elite midfielder to build a midfield around. You know? So today, I hope everyone who was laughing at him or laughing at anyone that rates him, now that you used your own eyes, because listen, I have a lot of Liverpool fans and big up uh, friends and big up to them. Aside of everything today, they were saying he's him. They rated him. They saw it for themselves because not every I don't expect everyone to watch all United games, but they saw it from themselves today and they saw how good this, this, this player is. So today he put himself on the map. I might put himself on the map in, in, in my opinion as well. Obviously, unfortunately, he got a red card, so he won't be in the game next game. He should have been a little bit more aware that he was on a yellow. But listen, I know a lot of people want to hate. Everyone's like, you know, they're trying to gaslight me today, Hamza. They're like, oh, but that means now that City's going to win the trouble. Okay, so... So you're telling me I shouldn't have won. Oh, my, I'm sorry I won, guys. Next time I'll make sure I lose because you guys want Liverpool to stop the trouble. You know what? Let, 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 me, let me tell my team next, guy, next time not to win games. How pathetic of the excuse that is. They just don't want to see me win no matter what. They just want to see me lose. And for everyone who's saying, oh, you're flip-flopping this and that, I don't care. When it comes to Liverpool win City games, I don't care. Ten Hag, 10 out of 10 performance. Every player on the pitch, 10 out of 10 performance. Every all the fans, 10 out of 10 performance. Nothing about today was wrong. There's not a single criticism that I will say about my team today. Because today was about ending the quad hopes for Liverpool. Is it was it was it was about leave, beating Liverpool at home. Because no matter what happens during the season, I always want to be beat Liverpool. Even if I'm winning the league and they're getting relegated and the win means nothing, I still want to win it. Even if I'm getting relegated and I can't save myself, I still want to beat them. No matter what the circumstances are, I always want to beat Liverpool. And guess what? I beat Liverpool. And everyone who came into my comments today saying, hold that stuffy, hold that stuffy. Where are you? Queen Nadra, where are you? Listen, big up Queen Nadra, but you were in my chat today. What happened? I didn't see you after Diallo scored. I was worried. I was like, Queen Nadra's either breaking her fast or something happened to her after the Diallo goal. And not just her, everyone else. Everyone else. Listen, guys, you guys can respectfully hold that. There's no one that deserves this loss more than Liverpool fans. You guys are absolute scum. You've been talking so much shit like you've been getting away with it. When you beat Arsenal with kids, you guys laugh. When you beat Chelsea with kids, 
you laughed. But because we beat you today, oh my God, we only had the kids on the pitch. Shut the fuck up. Hold your L and move on. And rightfully so, Hamza's about to cook and rinse every one of you dweebs. Go ahead, Hamza. <clears throat> Yeah, thank you. Staffy, today, the world saw. Yeah? Staffy, they laughed at you. Every week, we put you at the bottom. You, Ziad, we mock you. Yeah? They say, oh, those spots are for them. Hamza, don't worry about it. You ain't going to spend time there. But look who's at the bottom. The biggest fraud from all. The biggest fraud in this country of all, that football club. That football club. Like, we grew up, we can say, we've watched all our teams lifting Premier League titles. Titles. Stuff you've seen it, man. Stuff you're the king. Jacob has it. Jacob has it. Jacob has it. Stuff you lifted it. Ziad used to see Ziad said, Yo, Hamza did it, man. So many Jacob times. What, Mo? Jacob hasn't. Jacob hasn't. Let him cook. Let him cook. Let him cook. Can we not? I haven't even spoken Yo, Mo, in the show. Mo, Mo, and Mo, Mo, him Mo. Up. Can we let the I professor cook? I haven't even it. said salam alaikum, y'all. Sa has let done the professor it. cook. Mo, Mo, Inter Mo, Mo. has done it. Mo can give a story. We can sit down and laugh. <laughs> Tell me a first thing. Oh, wow, wow. <laughs> Bro, this guy, if he tells me about his first thing, Tao. Yo, Hamza, look at the score, Hamza. Hamza, look at the score. Yo, yo, yo. Everyone is wrong with you. We won the league already, bro. What look at the score, Hamza. Oh. Hamza, look at the score. Well, it's the end of the I know. Barcelona beating Atletico Madrid 3 0. And these guys are oh. losing to Pizza. Can we, let, can we let Hamza, can we let Hamza <laughs> talk about, about, about Ziyad? Ziyad? See what you did, Ziad? Please. Please. Come on, man. Don't worry, Ziad. I've seen him. You don't know how to do it. Let me, let me go back to this guy. Oh, where the Liverpool. We. Yo, tell us something new. Tell us something I can say, wow. Wow, yeah, yeah. What have you done in this country? What have you done? I used to know a guy called Amin Walai. A boy called Amin. He was a Liverpool fan. A stuffy. Every single day, Amin used... I was in the championship. I was saying, why is Amin spending time with me? He was my friend. All United fans. Arsenal fans, sure. they'll argue every time. I said, yo, why don't you go and talk to them? I'm in championship. Because, bro, they don't want to talk to me. He was a nobody. He knew. <laughs> me and this guy were nobody. But at least I know where I was. At least Stuffy. Stuffy. I don't talk about my history. Because I know how bad I was. Stuffy. I know you're a big boy. I win the sad. Lifting invincible. I said, Hansen, you want to play that style of football? I said, oh, my God. One day, inshallah. I said, wow. <laughs> And then Ziyad will say, wow, Hamza, you want to win the Champions League? I said, yeah, one day I'll be there. And then I see this guy, Liverpool fans coming to me. I say, you have some shame. What, what are you doing in this country? They used to finish eighth, we're like, <laughs> next to Derby County. I swear, we're like to witness them. Derby, well, so we're like, don't talk about big club. We're like, what, what, what I saw? I used to see you at some seventh, Derby County. Go and Google it. We're like, go and Google it. 98, 99, that we count little kids in school. Yeah? Everyone needs to know. Emily Heskey was your striker for like six years. Get out here. Bro, you're nothing. I'm you're Birmingham signed. City. You, are, you know when that cost more? He was eating from free transfer. You are signing players like Coventry City players. Gary McAllister, four years old, bald head like that. <laughs> That's what you... That was your star signing. That was your... When when Sai was lifting Henri and say, I'm, I'm, I'm getting back. I'm, I'm getting Henri. Yeah? Ziyad say, yo, Hamza, I'm hearing that. My guys, Roman's going to drug Balak. I'm saying, hey! I'm seeing Liverpool fans say, oh, you know, we're going to send a guy called Bernard Diomed. Huh? I'm back. Anthony Letale. Ego Biscan. This is your level. This is your level. No one looked up to you when we grew up. And then you bring club. Oh, Hamza, let's talk about Asan Wenger had an error with Fergie. Mourinho had an error. We remember it. What did your manager do? You always want to be my friend. Hamza, let's talk about club and pep error. There was no such thing as club and pep error. 
Humble yourself, Wallahi. Humble yourself, Liverpool fans. Humble yourself. You are starving. <laughs> you are starving. Fergie said, we will knock you off the perch. You didn't even do anything. I come there from relegation. I'm getting tired from Fergie. I can talk with Chas Staffy. Saad can tell me, your hands are, I knocked out Fergie a bit. Ziad can tell me, what did he do? What did he do? What did he do? What did you do? What did you do when you grew up? When we grew up, what did you do? Nothing. You go, oh, yeah, again, club. Jürgen Klopp. There was no Jürgen Klopp. They talk about Jürgen Klopp to Pep. Wallahi, have some shame. Have some shame. Let me tell you. Pep Guardiola. Liverpool fan. Wallahi. Pep Guardiola had the dream that any child dreamed. He grew up as a ball boy in Barcelona. Sitting there watching great Johan Cruyff giving the ball to him. He never knew. He will achieve that dream. He achieved that dream playing for his beloved club, lifting league titles for his club, lifting his Champions League for his club, playing with the greatest players that your football club will never even have. Will never have. Pep Guardiola played with Romario, Stoichkov. What are we doing here? Luis Enrique, Luis Figo are nine. And I need to come and get an advice from Pep Guardiola. Say, Pep, tell me what do I need to do next game? Where was your manager? Where was your manager? Your manager was working a video rental store. Wallahi. In England, we remember he had Blockbuster. We used to rent videos at Blockbuster. <laughs> hey, can I get Lion King $7.99 for a weekend? <laughs> Can I get Tarzan a week videotape? You can give him VHS videotape. Klopp used to hand, probably he's the guy that handed me the, the videotape coming to America. Eddie Murphy. Hey! I remember that. Hey! It's a body film, guys. It was a body film. Coming to America. He was he was lending people here, here, here. But make sure you tell me by Monday morning. <laughs> <laughs> My guy, my manager, oh, my, my manager was playing with R9. Wallahi, my manager was playing with R9. This isn't about that. This was is about the you. guy. Don't ever talk about that. You see Vanas. You see Vanas. Don't ever talk to Pep. You have no right. Talk to him about Pep Guardiola. Your football club. Tell your fans Wallahi. Tell your fans you have no right talking about Pep Guardiola. Your football club. Tell your fans Wallahi. You have no way talking. He played with the greatest players. And then guess what? While Pep Guardiola was playing with R9, his second job when he got sacked at video rental store, guess what happened? He used to, he used to load lorries. My guy used to load lorries milk like this. Eh, one milk, two milk, lorries. Are, hey! Yo, don't ever talk to my manager, Wallahi. Wallahi, I know you're putting your head like that. Have some shame. You come, 115, 115. I'm humbling you for that 115. One from remember is bigger than your club. I will remember that. Bigger than your club. That. Bigger than your club. Go and ask. I, I can that. ask him out. Tell me about lorry. How do you how do you put milk in the lorry? I can go and ask your manager. What a play. What a play. Now my manager, you go through his phone book, you find hey Hans, who do you want to talk to? Xavi, Niesta, Ana, Ronaldinho, Ana. Your manager will have Alex from the lorry driver. The other Steve from Blockbuster guy, the cleaner from the hey, he doesn't have that's where the references came from. Your manager, he said this well, I Staffy, listen to this. Well, I hear his manager, he said, This is what he said as a player. I played with Andreas Moller. <laughs> I thought it's a completely different game. He was world class. I was not even class. His manager said, well, I, he said, I was, I was not even class. He cast himself. He was a shit player after he became a video ready. He played Sunday League. Your manager played Sunday League, was a Sunday League player. Don't forget. Don't forget. He was a Sunday team. League. There's a level to this game. And then he went to, he went to university. Guess what he did? Staffy, guess what he did? What? You write thesis. Guess what he wrote about thesis, his thesis? <laughs> well, is a joke. Well, I. The manager wrote pieces about walking. Bro, how do you write walk? Bro, you just walk. What do you need to do about walking? Come. Your manager went to uni to do a thesis about walking. Bro, we... Bro, three years do you need to talk about walking? 
on thesis. You, that's your manager's level. That's your manager's level. Yeah? Never forget where you came from. Oh, Pep Guardiola. I called your manager. Yeah? I don't call him. Jürgen Norbert Klopp. Yeah? I called him German Ranieri. Bam! Bam! German Ranieri, I called him. Well, I get out of here. What's the difference between him and German Ranieri? What's the difference between him and Ranieri? One league title each. One Premier League. <laughs> Sit on the floor, Wallahi. Sit on the floor. When Alex, when Wenger, Mourinho, they can get in the room and say, I'll bring them a table, I'll serve them food. Oh, Alex, here, yeah, yeah, there's your fish. There's your nice baked beans, your Wenger. There's your nice cake, Mourinho. There's Ferguson. Your manager is sitting on the same table with Ranieri. One league tile each. Talking about league tiles. Ranieri would even say, have some shame. Hans, why did you put me in a manager that didn't even see a parade? Lifted a league tile in an empty stadium. At least I won in a full stadium. Fraud. Fraud. You talk about, eh, Liverpool's a big club. What have you done? Bought in league tiles. Crying every year. That's what you tell your fans. Hamza, okay, talk about the the, tw <coughs> the Trent tweet, the the hungry. For Let more. me go to that guy, that loser, one of the best generation of player of all time. He talks too much. He talks too much. He's cost you twice. The son, he's cost you twice. Don't talk early. I learned my game. I don't talk. I don't tweet early anymore. Trent did it again. The last one in four. Put that video, put that tweet up. Oh, got one. And he's lifting a cranny cap like that. They have some shame, bro. Asking your friend to take a picture of you. You walk your can, Bro, have some shame. You're generational talent. Why are you lifting a cranny cap like this? At one in four. <laughs> dunked by who? Me. Me. Let me show you that bad lip, Bufan. I dunked on him. I dunked on that guy. Tell him. Come outside, you fraud. Generational right back. League tie cried like a boy. I gave him Madrid. I said, Madrid, Benzema. <whistles> Do that job. Hey, I put my feet up that day. Vinicius cooked him alive. I knew. What happened? He picked another loser medal. You paraded an FA Cup and a Carling Cup. Never forget that. <laughs> you think my manager will do me that? No. You paraded, and this year again, he gave a CNN an interview. Oh, yeah, we were in a quadruple. We have to have some shame. Don't you ever learn? Don't you ever learn? What quadruple, your son? What quadruple? How can you call a Europa League part of that quadruple, bro? It's the baby quad. So we call it the baby quad. It's not a real quad. It's a, it's a baby quad. Daffy, a quad rupa is the Champions League. It's a baby one. It's okay. We'll let them have it. It's the baby quad. How can you brag? Well, we gave them a quad today. We gave them four goals. So that's the closest they'll get to a quad. You can't even do it. Jürgen Klopp took in his last season. He wanted to be a quitter. Your manager's a quitter. Just remember that. Your manager's a quitter. I don't like quitters. Your no, no, then Hamza is, United is crazy. He's a quitter. He's then, quit. then he's Hamza, then he's calling the reporter out of shape or he calling him fat after the game. Have some shame. What like shit, bro? He got what like you rattled. Answer the question, you fraud. Why are you always in Europa League? Well, how many times have you finished second against Pep? Twice. The rest of the time you finish in fifth and eighth. That's what you're good at. How many times have you played Europa League with Liverpool? And then he said, I can't do it. Um it's my final. He looked at the camera like, it's my final year Liverpool fans and I can't do it. I'm just tired. Ah! Who made you tired? <laughs> who, made, who made you tired? Talk to me. Who made you tired, Sam? Who made you? That, who made you run away? My brothers, a, come just, outside. Mm, my brothers here, come let me hug them. He's at, <laughs> he's, he's oh, Madrid, energy, yeah. man, me and Madrid did the job. Day, we're like, we're a day. Where yo? Yo, we're a day. And then stuff he said to me, Hamza, I'll stay. Leave that job for me. You've done it last time, Hamza. Leave that job for me, man. I said, Stuffy, can you do it? Kasimino, Hamza, please. wallahi, Hamza, when we drew them, I came on his channel in the comments. I said, Ten Hag's got something for you in a few weeks. He said, Well, I have something for you 
clip that. Where's the clip? I don't see the clip. Well, yeah, did you stop get doing that? an Egyptian accent? <laughs> Where's the clip? Me, before the game, clip? I don't no. say that. I say that. Before the game, there you are. The, the shamelessness. Sometimes there you are. Some I roll my R's, not my THs. Listen, some people say, there I beat you, you United Safi. I beat you 6 1, yes or no, with exactly. Ferguson. Unfortunately. I want to win the league title, yes or no? Yes, you Yeah? Do. They beat you 7 0. Where did they end up? Europa League. <laughs> hey! Hey! That's the difference. The man, Trent says, oh, it's okay. It's okay. You know our trophies, yeah? We haven't won much, but our fans at least appreciate it more than Man City 5 League title. I'm thinking, no wonder Usam is this happy. Your standard is low, Usam. Your standard of your football club is low. Stuffy, a player says that to me. Get out of here, man. Push it. You're not a Calvin Phillips. Joking. My football club's on a trophy. Oh, it's, it doesn't matter how it's context. It's how you win it. And how... I don't give a shit. Give me the title. I'm taking you home. Usam, I'm... You look at your smoke, you're already, you're stressed. Hey! Already even the show's not halfway. <laughs> My guy's picked up a cigarette. <laughs> hey! Hey! Listen, no. Hamza, at the end, Hamza, at the end of the day, Ten Hag has a chance. I'm not saying we're going to win the FA Cup. I don't think we will. But if he does... No, he, Safi, if he, you're not under pressure. I don't Safi, think I will, I will win, Hamza. But here's team. the thing, Hamza. If I do win the FA Cup, imagine this. In, in clubs last year, I'm going to have an FA Cup in a top five or whatever finish that we're aiming for, mm. while well, they're going to have a curling cup, a league cup, and if they don't win the league, that's his farewell. Oh. Imagine having a worse season than Ten Hag in your farewell season if you don't win the league. Imagine. It's insane, Hamza. Imagine. Imagine. Well, it's insane. Era, well, it's insane. Ten Hag, we said, era comes to an end. Ten Hag, I said, Hamza did it. I did put the dagger in. Look, he look put the dagger in. in. Where was, let me talk about some players. Mo, oh, come outside. Mo, your Egyptian brother, you called me out. You told me KDB was substituting a big game. Why was Mo Salah substituted in a game that meant so much for Klopp? Ball job. You know why? My boy, Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Here, well, he lives here. He lives here. I know him right here. Aaron Wan-Bissaka, wallahi. Wallahi, he lives quite a few, few Aaron meters away. Wallahi, guess what? Oh. Bang. I said it to, 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 to Man United fan. He will pocket Mo Salah. He wasn't, he wasn't fully fit. He wasn't fully fit. And he pocketed Mo Salah. Big up Arawa Bisaka. The Croydon boy pocketed him. Your boy had to be substituted. <laughs> Your boy had to be substituted. He ran away from his country in January. Couldn't stand to support them. Ran here. Didn't win a Carling Cup. Didn't even participate. And then got a troll, cut, already a cut, and they have some shame. And he cost you today because he was in power there. Eh? And there was a United fan mocked him, he smiled. <laughs> Don't you have some shame? Don't you cry? Don't you cry? Don't you have some shame? Mo, you told me KDB got substituted. He got substituted against the rivals. And he got substituted against the rivals. Don't ever talk to me about Mo Salah. Where was he? That's why Mane was clever. Mane said, Hamza, this is life. They're singing, you will never walk alone. Let them walk alone by themselves. I'm going to get trophies. He listened to me. Boy, he went to buy and he, went, he left the league towel. Bang. What did Mo Salah do? And I dare, I dare Ateta win the league. If Ateta wins the league, I don't get dumped. I tell you, me sad because say, Hamza, thank you very much. You helped me so much. You know, you're one of my. Without me, I was in the mud, Hamza. You helped me. He can, we can talk sometimes. We'll banter. But if Ateta wins one league title and Klopp has one league title, massive conversation is going to be held. I'm going to open that chain one. I'm going to say, yo, Ateta, my coach, my coach, I told this guy, he didn't even finish uni. Your manager did the thesis of walking. My guy didn't even do a thesis on me. If he wins one league title ahead of club Liverpool fans, hey, you gonna, we will come for you. Not for Man City. They'll never come for Man City. I've got five. I've got challenge. I can talk about it. I can say, oh, do fight. You can never talk. 
Arsenal fans will say, we won it on a full stadium. What did you eagerly say? Well, it's going to irritate you. They say, yo, I don't even class. They say, Hamza, I didn't even classify his one because there wasn't even one guy in there. You see, when you see FIFA, you only win a tournament. At least there's little images of FIFA. There's their fans doing that. There was none. What are you going to say to your kids or someone you're older? Daddy, show me a league title that you won in a stadium, full stadium. Why is Saad's kids say they want a league stadium in a league full stadium? Why is you going to say, I can't, I can't say because you're going to be ashamed. Ashamed. Let Arsenal fans not win this league title. Let Arsenal fans not win this league title, Liverpool. Because you will be the biggest fraud in this country. And today, big up Amadiallo showed what Mo Salah should be doing. Led. And he took off his shirt. Yeah? And you know what? He celebrated. He said, your Hamza, I came from pizza topping. I came from pizza topping league of Mo. But this is what I do, Hamza. I nearly even called Mo. I said, Mo, I apologize to call you league pizza topping. You know, I nearly called Mo. And I said, Mo, I can't cut, but you gave more. <laughs> Hold up, Mo. Status now. I can't chat to Mo. You know yeah. what? You know, you know what, Hamza? They told me that that we're gonna get Ramadan Salah today. They, they, they got Ramadan Diallo today. You know, the one that was Ramadan. actually fasting, who ended up bowling out. Not, not, not that one. Salah literally yeah. scored. You guys. And, and guess what? No, you, you, you scored deflected. Go have some shame. Wallah, you scored deflected. How many what deflected goals did you score? Two. Hamza. You the, beat Newcastle with you, two, you deflected goals. Goals. two deflected goals. You they scored Newcastle two deflected goals. You beat Newcastle with one United goals. team, and they scored beautiful. And they missed open chance. Rashford should have killed you. The uh, McTominay should have killed you. You had warning. And you know what? Ten Hag can say, Hamza, I beat Klopp was in this league. I played him three times or four times. He's beaten Klopp twice. You've only beaten him once. Huh? So you need to beat him to equalize. Hey! <laughs> you all discussed Ten Hag. You all discussed Ten Hag, yeah? You say to me, oh, Klopp. Ten Hag has beaten your manager twice. Your manager has beaten Ten Hag once. Hamza, you want to know another stat I figured out today? You must to equalize <laughs> Hamza, you want to know another stat that I found out today? When we eliminated them, that's us eliminating Liverpool from the FA Cup 11 times. The most in history to get eliminated by one team. That's heritage, Hamza. Heritage. You know what that is? That's heritage, Hamza. And 11 FA times. Cup. Don't this FA Cup are on sad. We'll don't give you a reason. Like you, 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 you put it out the, the buzzword for him, bro. Well, like, you put it out the buzzword, the heritage yeah, word. Same well, thing like. you mock sad for. <laughs> and, and lastly, that I never mock sad for FA Cup. I love that 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 that. Wallahi, just wait till I respond. Shobo's lie. I'm letting you speak. Just wait till I speak. Wallahi. Shobo's lie. They said Shobo's lie. Shobo's low baba. Ali baba. There's a good SUV in Kenya. When we were in Kenya, it's called Ali baba and 40 thieves. <laughs> this guy's one of the thieves. This guy spent right. 80 million on him. Two fraud. <laughs> he so smiled when they mocked him. <laughs> There's a fan that was making mockery. I thought I was some shit. What lawyer at least Enzo? Ziad, when Enzo's getting mocked, he's like, yo, what are you doing? Put that about to, It was about to punch him in his face, bro. Like, you don't, don't ever look at me like that. you will punch yeah. him in his face. My guy was smiling. Alibaba and 40 thieves. Was one of the worst signing, probably uncomfortable coming. And Darwin Nunes, you always pray. You know why? Any other club had Darwin Nunes would have thrown you under the bus. Yeah? You, your fan base, because your standard is low, you will take anything. You're still praising Darwin Nunes. He still continued to play. Jurgen Klopp refused to take him off. And Cody Gapo announced a shocking signing. Those are Klopp's shocking signing. That's why he's walking out. It's too much. It's too much for him. He can't handle Arteta pressure with uh, pe pressure. Spanish. It's called Spanish. This Spanish pressure is mad. Arteta and Klopp. Arteta and Pep are causing Klopp massive stress. My guy today walked up. They asked him simple question. What happened yesterday? Today? You couldn't cope with it. Oh, is that a stupid question? Or do you look? Why are you cussing the guy's looks? Have some shame.
Dick Bro, he Whoa. asked it. Hamza, Hamza, he asked, he asked, he asked the reporter asked Klopp, yeah. He was like, he was like, Do you think there's too many games? He's like, bro, you're not even in shape, bro, to be asking that question. Bro, what, <laughs> why would you bring someone's shape? He's asking you, why you <laughs> why did you not deliver today? Why were you second to every win? Why was United Kobe Minor done? You said Endo, hey. you said Endo and McAllister, Endo is so special. What did Endo do today? <laughs> He's another Henderson. What's the difference between Endo and Henderson? Same guys. Yes, and Cook by, that cook by an 18 year old, bro. He said, That's Oh, he, he did so. Kobe Mino, what a talent. He thought he was Enzo, bro. We're not getting locked That's up. We don't, get, we, we don't get locked up by this. Look at the talent Man United produced. We're overrating the fuck out of this Mino performance, by the way. Wallahi, he was fantastic. Wallahi, what a player. There you are. Kobe Mino, what a talent. There you are. He wasn't even that good. He, was he, 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 cooked, you. Good. he cooked you. He, he went past three players twice. Nah, three players so. cooked them, left them with noodle, noodle legs. Twice. Sad, if, 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 if McTominay finished that chance... If McDermott finishes that chance that came from him, if Gakpo finishes that players, chance, if Diaz finishes that no, chance, no, 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 that's not what I'm saying. Ma Mano dribbles three that's players. That's what I'm saying. Gives it to Rashford, I think. Rashford squares it. McDermott doesn't finish it. That you're goal scored. Uh, we're talking Mo, about this goal. Safi, if before he scores, we start talking about the game, can we just to finish? We're gonna give, come to the game and talk about the game. I just wanna. What? I'm not gonna like. I'm not gonna. I don't wanna cook. I don't wanna say anything. I just wanna say to the two thousand people here. I took my cooking like a champ. Sam called me. Staffy called me. LB sent me a message. Dan Potts sent me a message. I tried to call Hassan three times. He locked his phone. He never looked at his phone. And he addressed you guys in the chat. And he mm. called you bozos. Mm. He called you bozos mm. in his chat. The mm. Liverpool fans that you guys support him. He never he picked up his phone. Mm. I picked up the phone from the first time. Mm. Staffy mm. called. Hassan called. Mm. I picked up the phone. People that mm. sent messages, mm. I played the messages live. Hussam chickened mm -hmm. out. Hussam didn't mm. pick up the phone. I'm not going to call out Liverpool. We'll talk about Liverpool and the bottle job of Jurgen Klopp and how he mismanaged the game and the pounds for pound mm. better manager than Pep. We'll talk about that later. I'm not here to talk about <laughs> Liverpool. Yeah, I'm here to talk about Hussam. Mo, can yeah, I have you on that as well? Um, he didn't he did call. pick up the phone. Yeah, my he didn't pick up the phone. Was on yes, silent you made and I that on purpose. It doesn't why matter. Why didn't you write on the chat? Why didn't you write on the chat? Need to to no, 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 no. You know why? You because I, I sent people, I sent people to your stream to write Shame. pick up for some calling. Momo, you, you know what happens when, when, when I used to call him. See the difference? I'm Lala not gonna call out Liverpool, I'm not gonna call out Jurgen Klopp. The bottom of the game, same. it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. FA Cup, it doesn't matter. We'll talk about the Take game your, and how Jorgen Klopp mismanaged the game <laughs> and the pound for pound and all this shit. Shame. My not... problem isn't with Liverpool Football Club. My problem with Sam calling his fan base bozos and not picking up the phone. Because I Why picked didn't you tell me pick up in because the chat? I don't need to. You knew the people. Yeah, I know. Uh, mm -hmm. You uh, knew the people. Bro needs people instructions how to answer a phone. That's crazy. Calling. I am sure. Yeah, I don't know. know. Twenty twenty. Like, you, like, you, you didn't tell me to pick up a phone. When a phone rings, you pick it up. That's just what happens. My phone was on silent. My phone was on silent. I picked up, guys. I look. I knew that. I knew when Inter got dunked on. I knew someone would call me. By the way. LB Shame. didn't text me in my chat. Dan Potts didn't text me in my <laughs> chat. <laughs> Staffy didn't text me in my chat. But people sent me messages. But I'm brave and I responded to them. You put your phone on the other side and made it silent <laughs> on purpose because you didn't want to take it. That's fine. Mm, You're taking shame. it now. That's my only problem. I'm not gonna cook Liverpool. Okay, no, I I'm not gonna do anything. Staffy. You just didn't pick up when we were when we were all I'm gonna up. say. When we were two, I'm done. I'm over. Stuff. It's over, bro. It's over. You don't need to respond. It's over. You no, no, no. There's only one, one fact. That's only one fact, bro. Just you everybody in the chat. <laughs> Buzz will be late. We, we, we don't care. We don't care, bro. We don't care. We don't care. I'm shame. Nobody here. I'm Anybody shame, care? Sam. Stop it. You care? Stop it. You care? No, no, no. I don't care. I'm done. You care? There is no such thing. Nobody cares. No there is no cares, such no thing as nobody cares. cares. My phone, cares. I didn't even call Staffy when we were two and up. Matter. My phone was on silent from minute one. It was literally there. Like, it, was, it wasn't there. Bro. I didn't see. If you that told me, right. if you messaged in the chat, pick up, I would have picked up. To. But you didn't message me. I don't need to. Anyway. Yes, I you need to. Because I, said, I said, I said, can we speak about the Liverpool World Tour? Can we speak about the World Tour? 
how uh, Liverpool went from Colombia, they went to Bogota, they picked up some random, you know, they were doing they were doing inter moves. They went and picked up a random guy from Bogota. You know what I mean? They went all the way down to, to Argentina. They picked up some other random guy. Then they went up. They went all the way up. All the way up. And they, they, they asked Mo. They, 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 asked, they asked Mo. They <laughs> asked Mo. They asked Mo. Oh, who? Mo, where, where did you? You know that Klaassen guy? Where did you get him from? <laughs> where did you get him from? And and Mo was like, yeah, yeah, you know, you go you go down Amsterdam High Street, you go down the red light district, remember? Tell your guys don't look left or right, yeah? In, in the red light district, it gets techy over there. Don't look, look forward, left or yeah. look right. Yeah, look the forward. windows, yeah, just head Ramadan. forward. Head forward. Ramadan. They, they, they went to the shop. They went, they went to the... They went to the shop. Can I land? Can I land? Can I land? I sad when Sad speaks and he has a haircut. Let him speak. It's the fade speaking. It's not sad. It's the fade. Come on, man. It's the fade. It's not even me. It's the fade. Anyway, they the Mo told them specifically there's a shop on the corner. You have to go to that shop. They've got Klaassen. They've got Gakpo. They've got everything over there, you know? And they went and then and then their lights, their eyes lit up. And they were like, oh, Gakpo. He's got a bit of talent. He's a youth. He's a youth project. Wow. Wow, let's go, let's get him, let's bring him back. And then on the way, on the way, they went they went over to Budapest. Budapest, they said, you know what? We need a number 10. We need we need a number 10. Let's 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 get let's get the Hungarian exactly stuffy, the Hungarian Bruno Fernandes. Bro, Bruno with his foot. Bro, Bro, this is it's Bruno with swag. He's he's Bruno with a haircut and a dentist. Bro, That's the only difference. Yeah, well, yeah. He's a, bro. It's Bruno. It's Bruno with swag, bro. Bruno with Bruno. Bro, with have some respect set. for Bruno. Those well, those right. chompers. That's Bruno, for biting apples and stuff. It's, no, no. That's because he's a. You rat. like to bite but other stuff. That's by the bite. That's by the bite. You know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> Bruno helped us with the cause. Bruno helped us with the cause. But they went and they gathered all of these guys up. These random guys. Yeah. And then they 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 returned back to the same the random guys that knocked you out the FA Cup. Wow, wow, and then you just got knocked out by Manchester United. Manchester and you United, got knocked out by even... the team that Manchester, lost United. Manchester United, Manchester United, yeah, yeah. You got Manchester, United. United. You lost to Manchester Bro, United, Manchester United, at least Bro, they did on the you floor. Do sit it. on the floor, Hassan. When you came to my when you came to my ground, I, I played around you like like kids. I made so you why look did like you kids. Then? Raise have your hand shame, if you have some shame this year and sit on the floor. Raise your hand if you beat Liverpool this year. This was him. Jacob, you're missing your two. Oh, sorry. I wasn't listening. Someone said my name in the chat and I was about to call raise, him. Bozo. Raise your hand. Just raise your hand. There we go. If it's against the Sam yeah. this week, I'll do it. There Ziad couldn't yeah. raise and Hamza couldn't raise. There I mean, go. we have a lot. We're taking to be able to lost in the league. So. <laughs> I mean, we Stop haven't lost in the league, so technically yeah. I'll put my hand on. Let, let, let me let me let me just say let me just say this. I've heard the Hamza cooking and Staffy and, and all this. We're gonna open up the floor, we're gonna have a conversation about the game. First and foremost, Thank you. Hamza is the biggest fraud in this entire universe. No, Hamza, I'll ask you one question right now. Simple question. I no, 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 no. Don't don't deflect. Because with me, you cannot score a deflected goal. I think you watch a lot. I would have done it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You cannot score a deflected goal. I'm not Newcastle. Hamza, who's the biggest club in England? European heritage? Don't change because I have no, clips. No, you can't do that. I have clips. Answer the question. You have. Who's you have. The, you're the biggest Who club. Who is the biggest club in England, no, Hamza? You're the biggest club because I respect Champions League. More. There you are. There you are. But, this is the but same I said the truth. I said I grew up. Second, you're not winning one anything. Second, you're about right. to get dunked on. You you're didn't have anything to. I one didn't see you with anything. Dunked. Tell me. This is the Let same speak, guy. Let him finish. This is the same Scouse guy. Mistake. This is the same guy that told me Liverpool are the biggest club in England. He starts his speech with, "What have you done in England?" This is this is this is something that makes no sense. It makes when no I sense. Grew up. Doesn't matter. Doesn't yeah, matter. When I grew up, I you didn't told see me we're the biggest club well, in England. And the problem is, and the problem is, you want to win every battle, you end up losing the war. Did no, you not I'm, mock I'm right, Sam. Did you not? Did you not mock Saad for Bukayo Saka for him comparing to world class Salah? And Salah Salah's, was fasting yeah, Salah, today. He was fasting today, and he scored a goal. And it Ahmad wasn't Diallo was fasting, and he scored the winner. Ahmad Diallo was fasting. No problem. Well done to Ahmad Diallo. Winner. 
Humble well done to Ahmed Diallo. You, me, you know, you know, you know what it is. Me, the today, mean how many times was me, me, okay, let me let me tell you this. Me today, I don't Excuses. deserve this cooking. I don't deserve this cooking because I wasn't one of the happy clappers pre-game. I, I didn't deserve a cooking all season. I still. Got I, I was actually. <laughs> Listen, it is what I was actually on. Uh, I took it, no? I, I took it, no? Mish Hamza look, 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 look. Khaleto yehki. Shu amel akthar min akagum anot, yani. Anyway, Stavey, I, I was there on straight facts. I told you guys, don't let the Man United fans gaslight you. This is not going to be an easy game. This is Man United at Old Trafford. This is the biggest game in English football. And they're like, oh my God, Man United fans, including Stavey. Oh my God! Who do we have to hurt you? We have no one. No, it was an easy it's game, and your manager bottled it, Hassan. Your manager bottled it. Let me speak. Let me speak. I didn't interrupt you. They, they, oh my but God! But it was an easy no game. One. Don't lie. They tried to pretend that they are Cardiff City in the Championship, and now they come after the win. Oh my God! We're the biggest club in England. Oh my God! We're Manchester United. This is what they say post game. Pre game, they were acting like they're fifteenth. Now they want to act like a big club. I said from pre the game. This is Manchester United's cup final. And that's why staff is celebrating. That's why he has all these pictures up on OBS. Because if he lost today, it would have been season over for him. My season continues even after today. I still am challenging for two competitions. Had Staffy lost today, he, he had nothing to sing about till the end of the season. Because he doesn't even believe they're going to get top four. So he had nothing to celebrate from now to the end of the year. Saad is sat here laughing at the Hamza monologue. I'm the same guy that knocked him out the FA Cup to begin with. He was sat at home crying. And this was Saad, big up to Nick all the way from Australia, making memes. This was Saad asking us all to be objective about this club. Yes, when we and, knocked you him came, out and you came, and you came, and you came back to my house. You came back talk. to my house. Let me talk. You let came back to my house. For, I didn't interrupt any of you. Let me talk. Let and me talk. I was listening for a whole hour. You came back to my house for around two hours. Let me speak. Have some respect. Let me speak. I was listening for a whole whole hour don't interrupt your mid flow every single one of you here on the stream i own i have burned down old trafford five nil salah first oh. hat trick at old trafford since since r9 el fenomeno seven nil the biggest hold on, loss. we don't we hold on, hold on. Why, why are we allowing this hold on i'm sorry it's not democracy we are not allowing this no 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 we are not allowing this we are not showing this is a history lesson this is not a history lesson abibi even even when you got Ziad, Jacob, oh, Hamza, are we, is this because a, is I'm actually this? trying to talk. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm not, 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 oh my God. I don't know. Even, 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 even when you got cooked for the inter thing, we gave you space to clap back. And I didn't interrupt you. No, you're giving us a history lesson. Yo. Let me speak. Let me speak. This guy. Fuck you, Jurgen Klopp. Hassan, yeah. fuck Jurgen Klopp. Okay, <laughs> what is this? Ten, this what, is one. This? what is this guy saying? This... Fuck Jurgen Klopp. Don't interrupt me again, Mo, please. This guy is talking about 4 3. 4 plus 3 is 7. Forever in his Wikipedia page. But you ended Forever. up in Europa in his, in his... Hamza, one second, Yahi. Forever in his Wikipedia page. The loss forever in his Wikipedia page. And Hamza's mocking me for having one league title. I have one league title with zero charges. I'll take that. I'm not a criminal. Yeah, I want it the happy. legal way. You're happy. Saad is, laugh happy Saad is laughing at me. Saad is laughing at me. I saved him the biggest embarrassment. He can walk the streets of London because I beat his biggest rival in a Champions League final. Jacob's club's biggest moment belongs to Liverpool oh, Football Club. God. I went and I burnt down the San Siro with hard I Nothing beat Ziyad 1.5 billion pounds in the chat. I beat, let me finish. Yeah, I beat Ziad's 1.5 billion pound project with a bunch of school kids who had homework the next day. These are the six people trying to speak to me. Hamza starts his speech. But by you saying, what do yeah, one second. Yeah, Hamza starts his speech by saying, What do Liverpool do in England? And then a week ago, he was calling Liverpool the biggest club in England. So you can't come up here and waffle. No, I said, any, I record, walk. any record, I have it. Three Pete, I have it. How we many won a treble. See? We won a treble before. Yeah. We've won two Champions you Leagues. You haven't won a treble. What have... treble? I have more Champions Leagues than this oh, whole how, panel What treble did you win? What treble I have did you more win? Champions Leagues than this I whole I don't have you in the history combined. books of you won the treble. I have more, more Champions Leagues have... than this when entire panel combined. No, you don't. That's a lie. No, you don't. No, you don't, Asam. You actually don't, though. You actually don't. Huh? Well, it's not even England because my city have won as well. 
Yeah. What are you talking about? Uh, Safi has three. I uh, have two, and he has one. Have some shame, no problem. Man. No problem. You okay. don't know maths? Now the difference between me and Hamza is I'll blame my own players. Liverpool today did not turn up. Manchester United deserve to lose. Jacob, you can put up any picture you want. We own the biggest moment in Tottenham Hotspur Football Club history. You, you also own goal at Tottenham you Hotspur Stadium. Your so hold that. Squad cry in Shout Madrid. out Joe Matip every single time. Keep cry going. in Madrid because Look you at Oliver Skip, bro. When Oliver Skip's mocking you. your club, anyway. <laughs> you're finished. Anyway, hold back that. to the point. Today. Man United deserve to win today's game. We were not good enough on the pitch. And this is a humbler not for me, for all the Liverpool ah! fans. Who, 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 this is a humbler not for me, for all the Liverpool fans who thought that we're going to win the league this season. Yo! For all the people who think we're going to go perfect from now to the end of the season. For Putty Judge Mo being devil's advocate every week with LB and telling me about how Liverpool are favourites because they have the easiest fixtures. I told oh, them... Games, you are I told I told them games mm. like this, like Stop, today. He said he won the treble. James, no, hold on. I'm gonna respond. I'm gonna respond to this now. Are you done? Inshallah. Oh, it's gonna come on. Yeah, they're in a trouble. That's a lie. For some lie that they want a treble. They want a Carlin Cup, European Cup. Carlin Cup is not a treble. How? Have some shame. When I sometimes have some shame on your football club. Are you done? You don't have a treble. Ask anyone here. More. I, wait, I, wait, I, wait I, because I, I want to respond. I want to respond to this particular I point. That I have three because he's playing. Oh, Sam, can you finish? Oh, Sam, can you finish, please? Okay, I'm, I'm about to finish. Oh, yes, it's what the So the point is, Jimmy, these guys yeah. tell me I'm famous. That's why I say the Man, Man United away game is tough. You know, that's why the Man United fans have all gaslit mm. you into thinking today we're playing Cardiff. I told you guys this is the, their cup final. That's why Staff is celebrating. That's why yeah, all the you United made us look wait, like wait, 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 in five years, we already overtook them in trophy. They're off their perch now. Oh, yeah. He the said it. Now. This is why oh, this is on my wall. I'm knocking off oh, my perch. Don't I, I told you guys, don't know what I, I told you guys, yeah, don't get not a trophy. Don't get gaslit. Don't get gaslit by the Man United fans who are all out their caves now celebrating the trophy they won today. We all know they. Ain't, <laughs> we all know they ain't gonna win the FA Cup anyway. We all know they ain't gonna win the FA Cup anyway. So it doesn't bother me. Oh. We know this. So you know, big up to 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 Chelsea and City because the winner of that game will win the FA Cup as you, as we know. <laughs> Alassane, what the fuck? Yeah. That's all I want to say. Okay. And uh, I know you want to do the super chat. Before more, we're going to do the super chat. Before more, can you go, can you go to the super chat? They love to talk to me about more trophies. How is that? They didn't yeah. watch them. Guys, yeah, these trophies guys, were black guys, and white. Guys, guys, we have to do the super chat. Actually, my trophies were black and white. Arsenal's trophies were black and white. Because they were in the night. Well, I had the trophies. Hamza. I told you. Hamza, they have to Google the trophies. Guys. Guys, they had to Google. Right. I saw it with my eyes. They had to Google it. Guys, we have to do the super chat. We have to yes, do the let me just do the super chat chats before we before we, we carry we carry oh, on. Um, oh, 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 oh. Guys, we yeah. have to uh, anyway, that. guys, first of all, before we do the super chats, there's two thousand people in here. You've been waiting on this Hassan downfall. I'm here for it. No problem. I take my cooking like a champ. I'm not hiding. The only thing I will ask from you all is hit the like button. We should be at least on 1,000 likes. We're only on 800. Let's get to 1,000 likes. There's 2,000 people in here, you frauds. You've been waiting on this Liverpool downfall, eh? All of you are here. So, guys, let me just address the super chats. Let me just res respond so we can move on. Big up to Omar who says, need to stop throwing games away. Injury worries, for fuck's sake. Oh, there you are, Omar. There you are. Omar. Where's the 499, Ray Ray? The shit clown he is. He ain't anywhere to be seen. He ain't anywhere to be seen. Uh, Connor says, who's your daddy, Hussam, Ten Hag, Ahmad? Um, well, it's definitely not Arsenal, you know, the same club that are out the FA Cup because of us. It's, Big up it's to you, trust though. It's trust the guy has always got something in his mouth. Pause. That guy spoke for 35 minutes straight, bro. <laughs> but listen, I took it anyway. I took it like a champ. You know, we're here to get cooked. This is the game's the game. Big up Hussam and the crew. What an entertaining week. Some laughed and some cried. This uh, this football will surprise and humble the proudest of men and women. The ingredients are seasoned and marinated. It's time for the cooking. Hey, I can't lie to you. Hamza cooked. You get me. We got roasted. But we're out here. We are going to open up the, con the floor a little bit so we can talk about the game a bit more as well. <coughs> a bit less agendas from Hamza about 1938 and a bit more football talk. Big up to you, Jerome. Uh, w is Jerome for, for the Super Chat. Hamza's having so much fun this week. Bro, this guy's cooking everyone. And the funny part is, 
if Man United lost today, Hamza would have had the exact reverse speech, but about Liverpool instead of about he did tweet. He did tweet about us to make fun of us, and then the comeback happened. He was like, oh, the game changed after I tweeted. Allah is so shameless, Hamza. (laughs) Allah is such a fraud. Anthony think Liverpool was his ex-wife. What a hit. That's a crazy joke. I don't like the domestic abuse jokes, but big up to you. Big up Hussam, you called it yesterday. Bad feeling. I called it. That's why I don't deserve this cooking, but I'm here because I'm the Liverpool rep. I called it. I said we. I have a bad feeling about the game, but all the happy clapping seals have disappeared from the chat. Big up to Will, Will who says, Hamza, neighbor made me meal for United beating us, says Will. I can't lie, that whole neighbor made me meal thing is so bait because he cooks all of these things himself. Congratulations, Staffy, for your fourth three quarter final win trophy. Big up to, to, to Man United mm. for the trophy today. Uh. Big up to for for the empty super chat. Big up to Dan who says, happy clappers, it's the rate. Yeah, all the happy clappers. Oh, Liverpool going to win the quad. Liverpool going to win everything. That's what they want me to say. I'm not going to read that, Sunshine. GGMU, so. glory, glory, man. United. Big up, Sunshine, every time for the super Big up, Sunshine, for the super chat. Big up to Daniel who says, give Valve a raise now. Charles, hey, listen, don't worry. Val is getting paid handsomely this week, might I add. So big up to you, Daniel. I'm here to just say from the bottom of my heart, hold that Griggs is actually going to be on A-listers as well which Hamza will also be on. This is going to be a long week for me. But big up to you, Greg Z. Make sure, guys, go subscribe to Greg Two Z. Two weeks. NFC as well. Big up to Omar Rushdie. He says, hope it's lesson learned for the league game. Inshallah, important. But Omar, when I say this on the previews and you're sat there crying in the chat, talking about I have no mentality, now you can wake up finally. Big up to Uche. He says, on. Tottenham cold spurs. Hold that, you fraud. Pairs. Big up to you. Obsessed Uche. if you're talking Pairs. about me while we're roasting Liverpool, but carry on. I think he's an Arsenal fan. Hussam don't deserve this. Happy clappers do. Back the lads FC can hold that. Gordon Hamza should direct his cooking to them. Thank you. That's what Hamza should cook, not me, because I've actually been objective about the club from the start. I said but when I used to say stuff about my club, not a single person on this channel said, Staffy doesn't deserve this cooking. They're always, ha, ha, ha. Hold that, Staffy. Staffy needs to get cooked today. Ha, ha, ha. But when their Messiah gets cooked, oh, my God, they're so rattled. Let me send four ninety nine dollars to him and defend Hussam. Leave Hussam alone. Don't talk about guys, Hussam now. Guys, send, send, as many, send as many 499s defending me just so he can cry more. Big up to you, Qusay. He says, uh, Hamza, same monologue, different team every time. Qusay, you should not do it. Happy to you, Palestine. Qusay came to my channel yesterday and called me pathetic, me and Griggs, and he said, Hussam Army, where are you now, Qusay? I didn't see no super chats from you today. Damn. Where's the super chats, Qusay? Hussam Army. Hussam Army is crazy. Wallahi, he's Hussam Army. Wallahi, he said, you're pathetic, but not have an army. Hold that. Big up to Blaze who says, to be honest, losing to this Man United wasn't the embarrassing part. Letting one goal of the season, Anthony Net. Wallahi, I said it during the last year. Wallahi, Sharkan, too. We let two memes score, Anthony and McTominay. Astaghfirullah al Hey, hey two, listen, 12. McTominay has more open goal, goals this season than Cole Palmer, but these are conversations that we're going to talk about some other time. But let's go. Let's go. Hamza <laughs> is Amin, your imaginary friend, uh, being a Barcelona fan. Big up to you, Omar. Uh, big up to Qusay says, if you don't allow Hamza to say frauds, shameless, wallahi, standards, Fergie. R9, Gundogan, finally the most famous. Have some shame, he would talk. The funny part is he actually said all of these things during his monologue as well. Big up to you, Qusay. If Arteta did what Klopp did, the media would go crazy. That's true, because Arteta has not won anything significant in England yet. So that's why it's a different energy. Big up to Uche says, one minute about the game, 15 minutes of history, ham fraud. Big up to you, Uche. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed the FA Cup. There he goes, I enjoyed that. the FA Cup. Terrence, and he says, Terrence I don't says, the uh, FA Cup. This guy, bro. Fraud. Okay, well done. You won the FA Cup with Emery's players. Someone said Hamza speaks like this is a Twitter space and I can't unsee it. Unrelated yapping, says Terence. I enjoyed the are. yapping, Hamza. I there you are. Yo, that was, it was that very was good. good. From Hamza still. I hope the milk is curdled and makes you shit 115 times, Hamza. That would be funny. Oh my God, they're um, so rattled, bro. It's Gee, unbelievable, bro. bro. So oh my word. Your people, bro. My people are rattled as fuck. Like I've never oh seen that I when we get seen all that rattle. Mo, when you got cooked, people, did this amount of people right. defend you when you got cooked. It's all right. You know what is the difference? You're not gonna win all the time. Nobody wins all the time, unless it's Man City, probably. That's the <laughs> only thing <laughs> thing <laughs> no, but, but to be honest with you, they're so rattled. <laughs> 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 like, like, easy, easy on it. Just keep sending the super chats and keep supporting Hossam because he clearly. Need your support yeah. 100%. Yeah. He does. Oh my god, it's not only that Hamza and Stafir rattled Hussam, 
they rattled you as well. So keep because you guys, you know what? I'm done. Stop keep it. Keep sending super chats because you guys need to have a hug together. You know what? They got them all who said, Wallahi, Wallahi, Wallahi. Wallahi, Wallahi, you guys need it all together. It doesn't matter. Sam, Sam, Abibi, let me finish. Let me address the people. You guys need it together. You guys need it together. Let me finish, Sam, and then I'm going to come to you directly. Ya Habibi, Esko, see me, Akkalim. Esko. If you finish, then. بعدين حطيت المايك طبعا بنحاول يعني اول ما خلصت اول ما خلصت انا بقول لك انا عبي بنحاول نزق الموضوع انت ايه حافظ مش فاهم انت مش فاهم مش فاهم <تصفيق> مش فاهم افهم think مو 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 use your brain speak to the people مو they cooked you by the way the other day so get your revenge my god they sent Plenty of super chats to cook me. And when Staffy and Hamza rattle Hussam, they're like, oh, Hussam, Habibi, let us hug you. It's okay. Let us hug you. It's okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, Hussam, Habibi. Oh, don't cry. It's all right. Cook them back. He was so 99. Hussam, to cook them back. Oh, my God. Oh my God, guys. Send back. Send them because he needs your hugs. Apparently, he wants them. So send them more. Please, he wants them. Oh my God, Hussam. I am very happy for you, Hussam, with this amazing community that supports mm. you and hug you when you lose. They're absolutely Thank brilliant God. community. I you know what I like to call them? I envy you. You're so sorry for you, man. Uh, you know what I like to call them? I envy you about Victor today. I like to call them. I'll just call them so that we'll finish the topic. Allah and Allah and Allah, don't let us win the league title Allah. now, Hamza. I have a super chat saved up to flame you. I'm telling you right now. Oh, don't let me win this league title fight. because Hamza will have to quit YouTube because of me. That's what I would Hamza's say. Got Speak up to you, Mo. That inflated uh, head, though. Someone call a psychiatric hospital. <laughs> we got demented flip flopping running all over the internet. I can't oh lie. Hamza God. has flip flopped. The <laughs> fuck the They're doing what club does personal insults <laughs> because they don't know how to answer. It's okay, Hamza. Hamza, Hamza no. Man. Hamza, no. We'll say we won it over Pep. We'll no. Rod 1 yeah. 15. This confirms he's an Arsenal fan. Big up to you, Uche. Yeah, and if you and if Arsenal went as well with zero charges, big up, real club. Uh, one, he scored. Two, he's fasting. Three, he's back from injury. Oh. He's comparing Salah coming back from injury two days ago to Kevin De Bruyne playing two months before the game. Yeah, I had and a getting stinker, man. The that was, game of the season. Well, that was, the that game was shameful. Game. That was big game. up. For. Yeah, that was very shameful. Big up to Kuhn. That was very shameful, to be honest. Very shameful, <laughs> Like all he's trying, two one months time. versus one game, bro. <laughs> yeah, one game. Oli signed Ahmad. Apologize to Oli now, says cool guy. There you are. There you are. Big up to Hajj Ball, says uh, Hussam Malboro red on me. Akhi. Alhamdulillah, you won the energy cup. I told you on the preview that, you know, we told you. I told you I'm afraid of the game. I told you I'm worried about Man United. And you all gaslit and try to act like we're playing Cardiff. But now suddenly everyone's happy. Everyone's... Uh, you know, خلاص, it is what it is. Big up to you, Hajj. Make sure you guys go subscribe to Hajj Ball as well. Big up to Thrillo says, Hussam, woof, woof, woof. How's the quad going? I never believed in, in, in the quad, to be honest with you, Thrillo oh, from yeah. Manila. Uh, big up to you. Quick shout out to Amin for finding other friends. <laughs> <laughs> big up to Frankie for the super chat. Um, big up to Hussam's diehard fans. Hussam, the best panelist. Satanic club done it for fuck's sake. They did. They did do it. The satanic club. They got to Sakari Banya. What a name. Every time chat. Every time I uh, Hamza says heritage, drink something. Big up to you, I, Sak- I, I think. I think even you would vomit out the water you drank if you if you followed that rule right there. Um, big up to to my guy Hellboy says Mo. You took your cooking like a champ. Respect. So did I. You get me. No, uh, you we're didn't. here. You spoke for 36 minutes. No, you, you know, deflected it. You shamed me. Okay. You deflected You know, you spoke for 36 you minutes. You know, you know, Ziad, Mo, and Jacob didn't speak because you spoke for 36 minutes and you're trying to say I'm, I didn't take my cooking? Because they, they can't save you. Go on. Steffi, I left work two hours ago. I meant you as a club are pathetic and you cried like a baby and took it like a, an insult. Grow up, bro. Love, says Qusay. Big up I to have you, this, Qusay. bro. It's so crazy how I have a certain fan base on strings. You understand? You know, you know what a puppeteer does? He controls the strings and the puppet moves. That's what I do with this fan base. I just move and they start moving with me. I, I don't know who that was, right? though, but you were you were pretty shooken up on, during your stream there, Steffi. No, no, no. Yesterday on the preview, 
He said, uh-huh. but no, no, this, uh, let me expose him for being oh, a liar. Yeah, yeah. Me and Griggs, when we do shows, let me tell you something about Griggs. I have a f- personal friendship with Griggs. We talk about football all the time. Sometimes we go away from talking about the game to just talking generic football. For some reason, we found ourselves talking about the last two teams we had when we won the Champions League. So we kind of compared the players to each other. This guy came into my chat, my channel, telling me, you guys are pathetic. You're playing Liverpool tomorrow and you're talking about the treble team. So that doesn't mean that he's talking about the club. He's talking about us. Now he's deflecting and coming back with a super chat. You know why? Because I have him rattled. I'm the puppeteer. and You're the puppet. <laughs> Remember that, Kusai. I'm holding the strings and you're the puppet. You're moving with me. Big up to Hussam's diehard fan who says, Hussam, we will have the last laugh. There's an Arabic saying, Man And if I have the last laugh, I have three months worth of laughter this summer. Yeah, but do you know what the these, problem is? All these you guys don't wanna, You don't want to have chest, so you won't get... So that's the problem with you. That's the problem. Read this one. We support okay. real people, not frauds or corrupt judges. <laughs> Big up to you, Captain and Salah. And you know, Hussam, you're a hypocrite. 100%. Because you don't... All these corrupt... Don't now, wait, wait, corrupt. Hamza, wait, Hamza, wait, wait. Go ahead, Hussam. Read the last corrupt, one. There's, a, there's another one. We don't support... There's another one. Don't, there's another one. 115 charges FC. Shout out to Saad. Shout out to... to Mo, shout out to Ziad, to Jacob, to, to Staffy. They have they support real clubs, you know. There's one guy on the panel, he has 115 charges. The yeah, rest but guess what? Charges. Guess what? You don't you don't rate your manager to win the league. That's how much you think is a fraud. Wait, I'm you, no, no problem. Problem. Has a chance. So you cannot no, 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 no. you cannot no, no. have the no. last laugh. You Oh, yeah, uh, these guys are cooking bacon in Ramadan, Ten Hagen. Uh, what I mean is what I mean. Enjoy. صحتين علي قلبك حسام حبيبي يا قصي حبيبي تحياتي إلك ولاه الفلسطين كلهم كلنا معكو حبايبي. Big up to all of you guys. Two thousand people in here, guys. We ain't even on a thousand likes yet. We are not even on a thousand likes yet. This is fraudulent. You're moving like the Liverpool front three. We have two thousand people in here. We need to get on one thousand likes ASAP. Slap the like button. You can't want these guys to be clinical with their cooking and the Liverpool forward line to be manager, clinical and you're not clinical. The, the like button is free. Hit the like button right here, right now. Let's get to 1,000 likes ASAP. And now we go to footy judge Mo. Go ahead, no, brother. I just the floor wanted to is say yours. something. No, no, number one, by the way, you cannot have the last laugh if you don't say I'm going to win it. What I mean is that you don't come here every time and tell us I'm an underdog, I'm an underdog. I don't, believe it. I don't believe in my team. And then when your team win it, you say I have the last laugh. You, you can not. have the last laugh if you tell us, if you slap us all <laughs> every day, you slap us all every day, you said sit on the floor, I'm winning this league. Yes, and now you can have the last Ooh. laugh. So, so that's I'm believe. sorry, that's Ooh. that's just how how logic works. I cannot be yeah, like Staffy cannot be sitting here and say I'm not winning I'm the not. cup, and then when he Ooh. wins the cup, he's like ah, ha, 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 I'm laughing. Okay, that's number one. Number two, Osam, about about you just contradicted the shit out of yourself. Okay, I didn't. I literally told yes, you didn't. Because, win Staffy, the league this because Staffy predicted a loss for this game, and you let him do ha ha ha. Why? No, but uh, forget about him. <laughs> you cannot have the last. Oh, no, no, no. I said, no, no, hold on. Don't do that. No, no. Sani, mo, 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 Samani. Khalina Rud, Khalina Rud. There's a difference. There's a difference. Derbies, we celebrate no matter what. And I already said this a million times. I said this a million times. It doesn't matter what position I'm in in the league. It doesn't matter the competition. It doesn't matter what it is. When I see Liverpool... Derbies, we celebrate. Trophies, no. Yeah, no one's talking about a trophy. You're saying why you shamelessly celebrate. I am not listening now. No, no, because I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Because when it comes to Liverpool, even today on my stream, I said today I'm not doing no Ten Hag out agenda. I'm not doing no player agenda. Today, I just want to beat Liverpool and we'll live another day to talk about this stuff. That's the only difference. Mo is saying you can't say I'll get the last laugh and (laughs) call it before it happens. When you don't yeah. even want to back your team and say, that's what Mo said. Yeah. That's okay, and yeah, I'm saying, even if I say I'm on the drug and I win it, I'm still getting the last laugh. Time, you you laugh. Okay, bravo. I mean, no one will tell you not to laugh. Because my second part, part and your the second better. part is, you talk about Mo and LB telling you your favorites was the easiest fixture list. I still believe it. Do you know why? Because you controlled the ball today and had 15 shots in 50 minutes against Man United. You went to their ground and had 15 shots, right? And he had 67% win. position, but your manager bottled it. So you want to tell me it, that you are... Hold on. Hmm. But so you want to tell me agree. you are not favorites because your manager bottled it or because you don't have Shame. the players. Your manager is the one who bottled the game, not the players. 
Your manager is the one who made the subs and allowed Man United back in the game. Your manager is the one who let everyone go at the at the end of the game in a corner. Your manager is the one who did that at the end of the game. 120 minutes. I am tied 3-3. I'm going to let one kid, Connor Bradley, by himself defending. Did he not think there is penalties or something? Did he just forget? That's one. So today actually proves my point that you are still favorites, that you are still against Man United. You went to their ground and you went ahead twice, but your manager is the one who bottled it. Not the players, by the way. Yes, Cody Gakpo made a shit pass, but you have position and your manager from the sideline will tell them, calm down, we're winning. I think it was Nunez, up at right? Old Trafford. 2-1 up at Old Trafford. The pressure's on. Hold on. 2-1 two, one, two, one up right, at Old Trafford. It. And your manager think that the game is over. Telling Excuse his players, me? calm down. Pass yeah, the ball yeah. around. Robertson and Diaz passing the ball around. Uh, yalla, come drill. off. Come off. Break your uh, fast. Yalla, the the your, it's not your players that bottled it. Yes, noon is made. You know what? It's complacency. First of all, I'm very mm -hmm. sorry. Jurgen Klopp is a good manager and he always reads reads games well. Today, he's the one who lost it. So you cannot come with the energy today and tell me that because today you are not favorites. You still went to Man United ground and embarrassed them, bro. You went 1-0 down and you embarrassed them. Man United, go watch every watch along for Man United fans. They gave up, bro. The players of Man United gave up, bro. Bruno Fernandes raised his hand. Garnacho raised his hand and looked at the bench like we're not getting the ball again. We just lost the game. The fans went silent. So your team literally had the upper hand today. It's not on you personally. But for you to tell me that because we lost today, I'm not favorite. Bro, you went to Man United. You literally dominated them. You lost in moments, right? It, because your manager bottled that. Manager was a bottle, Joe. This is can the I, problem, Can I, can I give you a 10-second response? Yes, it's fine. I want to say one but thing. But I'm, I'm being honest, Hussam. This is okay, no talking football. I, you're being I'm honest. Really I'm really objective. objective. I am really okay. okay. I, I will also be objective. I promise you. No, I'm Another cigarette. When you have told me... <laughs> When you, <laughs> Hamza, I'm, mm. Hamza, I cannot smoke for 16 hours a day. Okay, let's <laughs> I'm, joking. <laughs> I'm never Hamza, seen you I have 16 you hours a day where show. I cannot smoke. I've never yeah. seen you smoke one cigarette in a show. Allah, 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 already I'm, made being, I'm being very objective. By the way. Said, he's he's no, 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 in his house. You know, because this is my opinion. I said it on my screen. Hear me out, hear me out. Give me an objective response. My logic this whole time has been what? We have four tough games to the end of the season. United away, Everton away, Spurs at home, Villa away. Those are the four tough games. Yes. Now, when we talk derbies, Staffy will tell you, when he grew up watching Man United, he saw incredible Man United teams with much better managers than even, with a much better manager even than Jurgen Klopp, come to Anfield against much worse teams and still drop points. In derbies, you cannot just push it to the side. Same way, Saad, I will have no problem whatsoever if Saad, before going to the White Hart Lane Stadium, is going to go like, guys, I'm worried it's a derby. Adi, it's a derby. It's not a game that uh, you can just win on paper. You can never, hear me out, you can never win on paper. Now, the, the thing is, what you said is true. But Sterf, more what the problem is? We yeah. have seen this movie before. You know which movie? The forwards costing us the game. Because it's happened against Luton, it's happened against Brighton, it's happened against Arsenal at home, and it's happened against Manchester City just recently. So the thing is, it is not, it is a combination of, it is a derby, and at the same time, I don't trust these forwards. Yani, nothing is stopping Diaz and Gakpo, again, in the Old Trafford game in the Premier League, from missing 50 chances. Wallahi, what's stopping them? Yeah, but, it could happen again. But you could have won the game. But that's actually, actually, I, I disagree with you. This game but proves to fail, tab, right? tab, I, you, it makes a, a, some sense. But also on the right. other hand, to respond to this, and I'm gonna get every, I want to get Staffy's opinion because he's a Man United fan. Doesn't this game prove to you, Staffy, that Liverpool are a superior team and they just bottled the game today? That the game is not as tough as they claim to be. For at least many Bro, the game wasn't goals. tough at all, Mo. The game the, I, I want you to go. Point, the, Staffy, you know, that's my point, Staffy. That's my point. That's why I'm agreeing with you. You know when you build momentum towards a goal? Mm. We didn't do that. Like that Anthony goal. I want you to go again and watch the goal because that's a goal that changed the game. Shit, Before bro. the goal was scored, I want you to listen to how quiet the stadium was. The yeah. stadium was dead at this point because like no one saw. Every time you, you guys got the ball, we never got it. Our press was, was shit. You could, Mo was right. Our, our players were flopping their arms around every time. You looked defeated. You can tell when a team is down and they don't believe. It was a moment that brought us back in the game. After that goal, we started peppering them in the last few minutes. And obviously went into, into extra time. And we had, I would say, the beginning of the extra time and the end of the extra time. They had a little bit in the middle. But if it wasn't for that goal, 
really, bro, let's be honest. Klopp was making signings like you guys are up 4-1 because the score yeah. didn't reflect it, but the performance did. The performance looked like this game has been over. I told people in my super uh, in, uh, in my watch along, I was like, I hope this, I, I want to end this game now because nothing is going to change. I was like, if anything, they might just score one more because we're not doing anything. We did absolutely nothing. Our midfield, bro, we look like a donut. I told my, I told them, our midfield is so bad, you guys walk into our box. That's why you guys were scoring deflected goals because we're allowing you to walk in our box. And you create your own luck at this point. You guys were absolutely bossing us. We did nothing bar the beginning of the game where we played well in the beginning of, I would say, the first half of the first Staffy, half. Staffy, can I ask you a genuine question? Minutes, it's 20, I, I went to the, uh, Staffy, it's can I ask Staffy 21 a minutes. When you, when Staffy, saying when you minutes. minutes. Okay, Staffy, well, just a genuine question. I agree with every word you just said. But my logic is as follows. What is stopping Diaz, Nunez, and Gakpo from doing the same exact thing you just mentioned again? Jad, what, missing chances? What? Yes. No, no, I, I'm not disagreeing with you that you guys sometimes miss chances. I hear that. You watch your team more. I get that. Yeah, I'm a Holland but you didn't, chances but every you, week, bro. But you didn't. I, I don't think you guys lost because you missed chances. I think you if lost because Mo was Holland, right. Mo, we'd be top yeah, maybe listen. Points. Yeah, but so Holland, Holland, listen, you, listen. Holland misses chances left and right, Yanni. Yes, listen, Holland misses chances. But you have City from the past teams. So, so this notion, it happens, Yanni. It's scraped past teams, Bordo, Yanni. We cannot okay, but when it. you say it happens, it's the thing that's happened to me multiple times. I said, hey, can I... Yeah, yeah, but Senta, you have been happened, winning yeah. the game. Yeah, but Senta, you have been winning the game. I don't want to... Sorry, Staffy, go ahead because I will cut you off. It's football. No, no, I'm just saying, I forgot what I was saying at, at the point, but my point was they didn't lose because they didn't score enough goals. They lost because Mo was right. You guys were complacent. It started with the manager into the players. When you're arrogance. starting to take out your best plays, I wouldn't say it's arrogance. I think it's just misjudgment. Because I Klopp don't think... Like, he was, like, guys, he was know, literally he, clapping Mo, them, passing the ball around, people. What he, Mo, this, this is what I saw. Mo, yes, this is what did. I saw. This is what I saw. I saw exactly the th same thing they did versus Arsenal. When they took out their best players and brought on their kids, the only difference is those kids won them the FA Cup versus Arsenal. Everyone was shocked. They were like, damn, I didn't think like uh, uh, Klopp was being that serious. Klopp did the same thing. He was bringing on kids, but this time he thought he won the game. And then he didn't win the game. And I think that reflected onto the players because the players didn't look serious. The one thing about United today, they looked a little bit more serious. They just don't have the technical ability that Liverpool do. And they don't have the same belief towards their manager because they don't know what the tactics are versus what club does. Like, club is a better manager than, than Ten Hag at the end of the day, so he gives you a better vi uh, idea of what he wants you to do. Just not the end of today, trying... though. Yeah, at the end of the day, yes. Just not the end of today. Like yeah, I mean, day. today I... he's not. Today, today's Ten Hag is superior to him, But Jacob, what's your thoughts on the game? You haven't spoken yet. Let me let me get your two pens on it. Um, I thought Liverpool really threw it away. You allowed Manchester United to play uh, the style that they wanted to play. I think... They showed a stat in the first half. There was like 12 to 30, or maybe right when the second half started. And I remember saying in Staffy's chat, like, this is a really fun game for neutral. I was enjoying it just because it was a lot of shots back back and forth. And, I mean, when you've got United forwards attacking, you never quite know what they're going to do. I didn't think they would do four goals like y'all allowed them to do. I mean, four goals to a really trashy United front three is <laughs> – that's actually very shameful. Um, that couldn't be my club as well. But – Overall, I mean, I thought Klopp just kind of... Uh, who said complacency? I think that was the word Me that I would use. Klopp was very no, complacent in that second You don't second think it was half. arrogant? Clapping on the sideline? No, and, no I uh, he's like, always arrogant. That's just baseline. That's baseline Klopp. He's always he's always rambunctious. He pulled a hamstring versus Tottenham last year. No, but the, uh, like, so the, the, the gestures he was giving to the players, like Jacob was like, calm down, it's okay. We got it's 2 1, bro. <laughs> You're not winning four. Anyway, go yeah, ahead. I mean, look, I, I don't know. I just think that uh, for the most part, it was Liverpool's game to lose. I don't like this whole Sod will do it. Well, maybe not Sod so much, but Arsenal fans and Liverpool, they do this thing. Oh, we're not favorites. Oh, this isn't our league. Hamza does it too. Oh, this isn't our league. This is, is that uh, yeah, yeah. we're not going to win this. As no, nobody everyone wants, wants to, no one wants to step up and be the man. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. They're all like, oh, I'm afraid to put my they're face out there like we're going to do something. They're all what? Say it. Say They're all what? Scared. You, you wanted me to say the other word, didn't you? <laughs> I didn't want to do it. But, you know, Sad. at the end of the Sad. day. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, Jim. I was just going to say, at the end of the day, Rashford uh, made up for what I thought was a pretty awful game. Title. Anthony? In your opinion, after watching today's game, toughest game for Liverpool left is Man United away, by the way. Toughest game. Who do you think is favorite? 
تو ويندوز اي ديس اجري اي ديس اجري اي ديس اجري يا ابن اسكت اسكت بقى يا اخي بقى ده ايه ده يا اخي انت عمال تقاطعنا مش معقول وات ذا فاك ام اسكت جيك ايفرتون اند يونايتد ناو ستينج يو برو اتفضل بس ام كي مع نو وير برو مثلا مثلا عندي سكريات تستجري Some if this was, oh, I think, if this was a Premier okay, League now, match, I, hang on, hang on, hang on. If, if this is a Premier League match, Klopp is not going to take out Mohamed Salah. That's just plain and simple. So to me, it was a little bit of reluctancy to really go for the cup, in my opinion, from a from a manager standpoint, to take off Mohamed Salah, who was he looked the most dangerous out of that entire front three, and that's just every other day. But it really just seems like he was like okay i'm gonna take Saul out i'm gonna try and protect my guy get ready for the league we've got this wrapped up 2-1 but unfortunately for him that just wasn't the case do you guys see now do you guys see before we go ah. on do you guys see now liverpool fans watch this liverpool fans went from man united today when we tried to press them a little bit everybody say no it's aston villa way it's tougher than man united where was the derby where is the derby the stuff is frozen i think so Yeah, I think he is. Yeah. So, man, Liverpool fans. There, there you are. He's here. He's here. He's here. There anyway, let me are. just finish this point there because are. I want to tell Liverpool the fans something. There, we, we are. We are I, catch Mo, you. Mo, I am not saying this to put pressure on you. I I'm saying this after I saw the the I saw the uh, the fixture list. That's after I saw the fixture list. After you went up, it's not. Uh, after you uh, the game with uh, with Man City, I'm not saying this. To, people think that we're saying Man City are favorites for the Champions League or Arsenal or this because we want to put pressure. No, I'm just being logical, right? If this is your toughest game, Man United, the Derby away from home is your toughest game. You have the easier fixture. Opta says that every analyst say that you have the easiest fixture list. Man City play Arsenal when Arsenal now are flying, so you guys just don't want to have the pressure, which is fine. Because you're afraid that Jurgen Klopp might not win it and he's going to have one league title. That's fine. But you cannot just sit here and logic me and talk me into your narrative of, oh, no, no, we have Everton away. It's tough. We're freaking Arsenal have Spurs away. Yeah, and it's tough not too. Everton. I, I, but I have the same logic for that. And Arsenal have Man United away. And, and Arsenal have Man City away. So by definition, they are tougher fixtures than you. Man City have Arsenal. Man City play Brighton away. Man City play Aston Villa as well. So Man City have the second. So Liverpool, you guys losing today in the manner, as Jacob said, proves that Jurgen Klopp will not have this energy in the league. He won't. Jurgen Klopp will not take his best players out. No. That's just a fact. Hey. I think I think in the I Premier just, League, I, Liverpool guys, do just, get this win. But also to all the Liverpool fans saying, "Oh, oh, oh Salah wasn't good. Salah wasn't good." I'm sure whenever KDB got hooked, they all said, "Oh, Pep should have kept KDB out there because a world class player does what exactly world class moments when you need it the most." So to me, I'm not buying this. Oh, Salah was crap in the second half, bro. He's a world class player. It's time for him to step up when you need him. And the fact that he was hooked and not even allowed that opportunity that is on Klopp. But I, again, in the Premier League, Mo, he's not gonna. I don't think he's gonna take. Yeah, those kind of not. moves versus Manchester United. So to answer your question, I think it would still be Liverpool are the favorites going into that. Okay, yeah. but here's the thing, Mo. You are, you, you're you being logical if I'm not keeping the same energy. So let's say we're doing the Ahwa preview before the Spurs-Arsenal game, okay? If Saad yeah. comes here and says, I'm worried, it's a derby, I'm not going to call Saad out. He has every oh. right to be worried about the Spurs mm -hmm. game because mm -hmm. it's a derby. And the reality is even Staffy, when they lost the league, Even Hamza, when they lost the league, even Ziad, his teams that lost the league, games like this, it's not played on paper. It's not like Chelsea, by definition, are better than, than Arsenal, let's say, on paper, like 10 years ago. Khalas, they're going to beat Arsenal every time. That's not how it works. And my logic is there is nothing stopping Diaz, Gakpo, and Nunez from doing the same exact shit again away at Old Trafford in the Premier League game. We could get, again, 50 chances and we could fuck them all up. This is the reality. And to look, my forward line is as follows, okay? Salah, world class. Best forward in the league, in my opinion. Second, Jota, in incredible finisher. Amazing. Always injured. So the three I have to rely on is Nunez, Gakpo, and Diaz. One is inconsistent, and the other two are crap. You see the Can problem we let Saad now? speak? Saad hasn't spoken. Also. Saad, I want to hear Saad, because Saad is in the title. Right um, Saad, listen, are you playing FIFA? For me, for, are you playing FIFA? No, 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 I'm not. 
No, no, I was. Looks bro, like relax. you are. He's, he's he's watching Kobe Mino comps. I don't I don't blame. No, him. no, I'm trying I'm trying to confirm. I'm like Kobe Mino. Confirm bro. a stat. I, I, I do. doesn't I really like, like Kobe Mino. I really like I really like the kid, man. Listen, um, Kobe Mino is a very good talent, bro. You can just see. The way, he, Whoa, the way he Griggs, played today, Griggs the way he played today. today. Greg said 150 million on my stream, bro. He's just mad. 150, yeah, Wallah, that's, that's kind. He said he said half a billion on my channel. Wallah, I'll give crazy. you a discount. It's crazy. <laughs> it's going mad, bro. If, if, I'm, if I'm being honest. Why is it crazy? Enzo was 100 mil. You can't add 50 for me. No, come on. That's some shame. If, if I'm being honest about the game today, and listen, this is something I've said about Liverpool uh, throughout the whole season, bro. Luis Diaz is going to kill that football club. Is going to kill that football club because the, the amount of chances this guy gets is criminal. It is criminal. The amount of clear cut chances that he misses is criminal. Me, Why? Me. Oh, the, yeah, but he does too much on the ball for the Luis Diaz. Luis Diaz. This I said it on my stream and I'll say it again. This guy is the best person you. This is the person you want in the build up, in front of goal. Fuck that shit. You do not want this guy in front of goal. You do not Nothing. want him to take a shot. Because all of a sudden, all of that, magic, that magical uh, play that he done to get to the place where he needs to score the goal, it all goes out of his head as soon as he gets in front of goal and he sees the net. So, Luis Diaz was absolutely shocking. Um, Nunes, I think, was trying. He was trying, bro. Listen, this guy, if, if, he, if, if there was a badge for trying, he's getting it. But he's again, not clinical, medal, bro. He, but but uh, but for the clinical, that's <laughs> liar on the league. You cooked, <laughs> but, but you cooked the, my whole argument. Yeah, you cooked but my for the argument. clinic, but for the clinic, for the clinicalness, bro. There's no clinicalness in that guy, bro. There isn't. Uh, he can he can score the goal against Nottingham Forest. He can do this. He can do it. it's a flash in the pan, bro. It just it happens every now and then. He might score a goal for you. He might score a goal last minute. He might score a goal in a game where they're winning 4-1. But when you need him and you need him to score in games like this, bro, the guy, the, bro, the guy's shooting up into the air. I mean, let's be serious. Let's actually be serious. The forward line for them is shocking. And the fact that Salah is the only one that's really respected in, in that front line. And even today... And he's the only one he, who scored, subhanAllah. Even with a bad bro, game. He, he's, 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 the only, he's the only one who scored and, and apparently... He had bad games. That's why I was checking. You saw me on my computer. I was trying to check. Apparently, he did not do not one dribble take on. He didn't want. He didn't do no, he not did. one take on. Uh, he, I think he today. put he put, uh, he put somebody on his uh, like somebody turned on the side. That was brilliant. <laughs> I can't remember one Bissaka or who was someone Probably he did like a dribble. Oh yeah, that there was, you are. That was, there, that there you are. That was, Hassan. Hassan, Hassan had to get his. The, uh, Hassan, you remember that play, Hassan? Huh? It was what the heck, bro? Was that they tell me Salah cannot dribble and he did that, and I'm like, whoa. <laughs> but, um, yeah, listen, their front line is shocking. Shobasly, not the listen, best. All these excuses, said, I'm sorry, before bro. I go get my uh, my pet, my uh, um, yes. my photo ready, I just want to say this because I'm, I'm sure you guys are going to move on by the time I come back. At the end of the day, we beat them with Bruno in center back, Anthony in left back. Ericsson in the six. I'm a Turn your camera that, off, bro. You froze. The low in the six. I don't know what's wrong with my camera. I might need a new one. Yo, send me some super chats so I can get a new camera. Anyways, <laughs> the low in the midfield. Ericsson in the midfield. And a front line of Rashford, Garnacho, Ahmad Diallo, and Maguire. This wasn't a team, bro. You know when you play FIFA and you're just desperate for the goal and you're Lindelof, like, fucking, let, let me just... 11 minutes, bro. Lindelof, yeah, bro, let me just bring Lindelof. everyone off the bench. That's what we did today. Wallahi. We did, uh, we, we did Bismillah football. Mm. You know, Bruno Tomini played 120 minutes, bro. <laughs> bro, 120 minutes. We had Bruno playing as a quarterback, bro. You guys told me to stick the, to NFL. Ten Hag brought the NFL to you guys today. He put a player in in the back yeah, line that wasn't a defender. Honest, Matthew, it was Klopp throwing the game away, being arrogant and like. To be honest with you, 100. Somebody, 100. Somebody, somebody said somebody said that Bruno Fernandez was playing quarterback, bro. Is that is that the correct? Is that the correct? That's what I just said. I said he brought the NFL to you guys. Bro, the guy couldn't just said the that. guy couldn't walk, bro. Yeah, well, the, the, wait, why did you miss that, walk. Right, you literally, I literally said, that said it like five you seconds what you just ago. said. That's crazy. Oh, my bad. Yeah. I'm, I, I, I said I it like five bro's seconds too busy ago. looking at his trim in the, the, in the, the reflection. Yeah, stop looking yeah. at yourself in the mirror, bro. It's yeah, okay. cut it out. Hey, don't gas me up. Get off the dating apps. Get off the dating apps. Get off the dating yeah, apps. I, think, I think that's what Sad does. Every time Sad gets a bro, pain, he goes on the dating apps and he puts a new selfie. And he's like, yo, look at me. I work for El Ahwa. 
<laughs> You're such a fraud. Look at me, yeah. I'm famous on the hour. I got 10k people watching me. <laughs> speaking uh, speaking of uh speaking put me on the bottom because I'll be back for, for in a few minutes. No problem. Speaking of frauds, there's a guy. Why, why, your brother? He thinks we can mm. see him. He thinks we can see him. He thinks we can oh. see him. Hey, run the clip. Run the clip. Have, run the clip. Have, 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 have you used the cardboard straw today? <laughs> Ben Davies, you're a fucking criminal. I hate you, Ben Davies. I hate you. I hate you. Oh my god, you are a criminal. You are an absolute criminal. You need to be thrown in jail tonight. I need your fu Send him back to Wales. Send him to Wales now! Talk to us, Mother Yaqub. You get me? You get me? There is a club, uh, you know, they had a London game in their own city. By the way, pick up the super chatters. I'm, I'm going to keep you guys till the end. We're going to end on the super chats. Um, you know, hello, brother. Get me. Hey. Uh, you know, mm. There is a football club with a guy that keeps yapping mm. and keeps talking and, you know, keeps staring us about how great angels and how we're not sky pundits. You know, we're not on Sky Sports. <laughs> yeah. Oh, watch out, watch out, Osam. You haven't been managed. You haven't been Sky waiting. Sports. Relax. Bro, you, relax. You ain't got the licenses to be talking right Subhanallah. now. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. Let me actually, you know what? Let me just utter respect for the Super Test. Let me just read them out first before I go to Jacob. Mo, what's your favorite Premier League club? Mm, nothing, to be honest. Bears. I, I really have no nothing. <laughs> there you are. It changes Big every season. Like, hard uh, to, but I'm sure you said this season you want anyone but City to win it. Liverpool or Arsenal for me this season. Okay, no problem. I appreciate that. Whoever stays um, until the end, I'm going to support them like in the last two, three games. Big up to LFC Badr says, Mo, I saw you hit 18k. They did you wrong. And now look, you'll surpass them soon. I'm so happy for you. And I subbed when you had just created the channel. Big up to Footy. Yeah, yeah, big up, big up, LFC Badr. Thank you so much. Big yeah, this is less opening up stuff in the past to get me with on any drama. Pick up to you better, Habibi, yeah, but shout out to my guy Mo every, each and every time. Of course, hitting 18K, shout out to you, my brother. Pick up to Hellboy who says, Dear panel, how did the best centre-back in the league concede three goals at Craven Cottage? 22. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it was, it was absolutely horrific. Horrific. Oh, it was Fuck horrific. horrific. Like, to be honest, Jake, I want you to see it. He was mm. horrific. Horrific. Bro, he he reminded he reminded me of that meme. What's a what's a polar bear doing in Arlington, Texas, bro? Well, like he's looking. Hey, put some respect on my hometown. The pitch. Go back, we'll go back to that. Uh, yeah, are you gonna tell us what happened, Jacob? Well, are you gonna respect Hellboy? Are you gonna respect Hellboy and tell him what happened? Well, no, well, uh, I'm too blessed. I don't speak to anyone associated with hell. Yeah, first I'm going to speak uh, for the next three and then I'm going to let Jacob uh, speak about the game. We have to hold the L. So arrogant from us today. We have to win this league because I'm sick and tired yeah, of that. being nearly men. I agree with you. <laughs> and I'm sick and tired of Hamza as well. I'm sick and tired of Hamza more than us being the nearly men. So, yeah. You know that you, your, problem, your problem isn't going to be Hamza. Your problem is going to be sad if Arteta wins the league this season. <laughs> no, but with sad, I always have a response. Forget the response. It's not going to be a response. It's not going to be about the club. The reality it is, is it isn't, bro. It isn't going to be about the Champions League, and it's not going to be about Liverpool versus Arsenal. It's going to be about club versus Arteta. No Arsenal fan will ever mm. chat to you and tell you, "Oh my God, we're bigger than you." They haven't won a Champions League, but they're going to sit here and say, "Well, your process lasted nine years. Our process is four years, and we won the league already." And you won one. That's what they're going to say, bro. They're already oh. preparing the titles, bro. The drafts are written. They're right in them. Everyone is right. Agree with Mo. When United game should win the Premier League 100 percent I hope so. I hope we learn from today's game online. I hope we do. Big up to Dinishan who says, Did Francis Munez score again? Munez, not Nunez, says Dinishan. Hey, hey. Munez, yeah. Jacob, first of all, a thousand seven hundred people are still here. We have hit 1k likes. So big up to you guys. You get me. We're already on 10,000 views as well. You frauds, you waited on my downfall. Make sure you guys are liking and subscribing. Let's be greedy. Let's bump up the likes even more. Um, 
So, Jacob, the floor is yours. You get me? Yeah. Boy. Let me start off by saying this. Saw it in any Paul Arsenal Paul fan Paul who's having a good Paul time with like this Fulham thing. Mo, I'm talking. Don't interrupt me. Can I speak? Paul you want me to play the Gohan like clip? To you want, you want me to play the Gohan him, clip or what? Can we cue up the Gohan no, clip? I don't clip people. Can I, I talk? People clip people. Can I talk? You're saying you want Jacob full screen? Of course. He told Sad full screen, say it. He literally didn't remember. <laughs> Hey, why you want me full screen, Mo? I think I just want to say your chest. Yeah. Say with with some Texan beauty, you know what I mean? They ain't got enough of that in Houston. You got to come get it out here. But look, with your chest. Saad and any Arsenal fan going, he, 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 this and that. Bro, you got one point off Fulham. Don't talk to me. Sit on the floor. I at least got three versus them bums. All right? Maybe I lost the second one. Yeah, bad day at the office. Can't say anything good about any Tottenham Hotspur player. I could tell you that much. But what I will tell you is this. Ain't no one wake up on Christmas morning on their birthday and say, hey, mommy, can I get a Frankie Munez shirt from Fulham? Nobody says that. No one even knows who Lukic is. All right, and Cascante, Castagne on the right-hand side, we made their fullbacks look top class. And you know what? I don't even know who the fuck Cascante is. So his family probably don't even know him either. Ain't no one want any of these Fulham jerseys. They're a bunch of bums. We took the L. We moved. Bad day at the office. Nothing I could say good about any any player at all. So there you go. Halas, happy mole here. We've put no, a screen. Happy, eh? This is worse deflection than Hamza. He started talking about <laughs> Fulham and Muniz. What, Crazy. what the fuck? What the fuck did I just hear, bro? This guy sat here instead of talking about his club. Started talking about uh fulham munez jerseys nobody wants their jerseys what about your <laughs> yeah. club he went missing and his mama didn't even put him on what the milk carton how sad club? is that couldn't be my club oh my god this is worse than hamza he literally deflected to talk about fulham he didn't talk about anything about spurs Look, I'm here. I, I'm I did. Here. I said there's not one player that I could say anything good about. <laughs> but that's not on Ange Postacoglu, the fact that nobody could complete a pass. There was 10-yard passes that we could. It just, uh, just uh, little fart passes. First half, so fart that's passes, on, left and right. Here's another on, fart that's pass. Not that's what y'all wanted. That's What'd not you on say, Steffi? It's not on Ainge, the fact I that the players it. can't fucking pass. Oh, so no, that's it, not it, on Ainge. You think Ainge oh, sat there on the touchline, so, oh, hang on. Oh, you think oh, he sat there on the touchline and said, oh, guys, when you pass it, only use half hey, of the amount of effort. Oh, whenever you're tracking back, down. only two. Let's, no, they let's, don't. Let's, let's you're get, a fraud. Let's get to the point if, if you, if you, If you are a manager, yeah, and you're on, you're on the touchline and you're looking at your players and the system that you've put out there is not working, yeah? They don't look as fluid as they normally do. They're not getting to the they're not getting the passes done as quickly as you want them. Yeah. As a manager with so many years of experience in 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 Australia and in Yeah, Japan, he's still gonna finish higher in the and, Premier League in his first in, season than your and, bozo manager. And in, oh wow, but what carry on. What a trophy. What a trophy that he's finishing instead of my manager at eight. Okay, Khalas. Listen, the first hurdle, yeah. Last, last, last stream you were talking to me about we're gonna finish above Arsenal. The first. Did you hurdle, be Fulham? Did you be Fulham hurdle. at all this season? Yes. Did you be Marco Silva and Fulham at all this season? Just okay, answer my question, then you can continue. Them. Did you beat them my, yes or no? My Did you beat them yes or no? You shouldn't even be talking right now. It park. should be somebody else who they can actually be Fulham. The park. But they bucked you off the park. My one was respectful. Yeah, let Ziad talk. I, I actually take what Ziad says even, more than you. you. Bro, score. you couldn't you did not beat them score, at all this bro, season. So I ain't hear nothing from score. you. Okay, okay. I ain't so hear nothing from you. I beat Wolves and then you got... Can someone else talk? Wait, anyone wait, who beat Fulham, can they talk? Can anyone who can get a result versus Fulham? One second, one second. Bro gets one point versus Fulham and thinks he can chat to me about anything. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, is anyone else going to talk? Because I ain't going to talk. Let me, let me say something. You got to be able to beat Fulham first before yeah, you can come chat. I beat Fulham. I beat Fulham. There you go. Let Ziyad talk. We need to speak let's about Bitch Boy Romero. We need to speak about Bitch Boy Romero and why he's oh, looking Oh, now like you're resulting like to insults, huh? You got nothing else? Yes, 100%. No creativity. 100%. You just got to think of whatever yes, yes, you can yes, think yes, of. Yes, huh? yes, very yes, mature. Yes. Very yes. mature. Boohoo Saka, and he expects me not to sit here with insults, bro. Get out of here, bro. Sit on See, the Boohoo Saka is at least creative. Boohoo Saka is at least creative. Bitch boy is something you say to somebody on Facebook. Bozo Romero. Bozo Romero. Or the this is football comments. That's not creative either. Just be more creative. That's all I'm asking. How attacking my community. How I only attack the, 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 the yeah, fake ones, five, not the real five, ones. Five, the five, real five. ones know themselves. Why Shout did out all the real get, ones. Why, why did Bassi bop him off so easily? He said, sit on the floor, bro. Let me score. Let me put the ball in. Sad, can, can I ask you what your point is? Because I, I tuned, obviously, I came in a little bit late. 
So I was breaking my. No, no, I'm, I'm, I, we need to speak about these players because he said. <laughs> let's talk about so Benjamin. Gassed up. Right? Because the team that you couldn't beat got a result versus us. You're all gassed up. I see you. Okay, can I say something? Okay, let me let me speak. So, Staffy, with all due respect, I let you speak. Yeah, let me have my turn. No, no, Khalas, and I'll speak about this. Bro, finish with them and I'll. Okay, Khalas, go. Khalas, Safi. I said finish and I'll go. I just want to speak about the game, Sad. Yes, you were interrupting Hussam earlier, Saad. By the way, Hussam didn't get a chance to speak on Liverpool, and Saad was sitting there interrupting him. It's interesting. Now he gets interrupted and he gets so upset with Staffy. That's really weird. To say that these players are so great. Where was Madison? They are. Fuck all. But don't fuck all miss shots. Bro, players and have bad games. Guys. Isn't that what you said about Saliba when he gave the ball away in Porto? Isn't that what you said about him? Uh, he did. But when you cook Jacob, he, he gets all flustered in his head and he has to talk. He can't just sit there in silence and take the cooking. He, he, he does get a little bit sensitive. Oh, Jacob, let's, let's hear outside. Let's, let's, have, let's, let's just hear what Saad has to say. No, I'm real outside. curious that oh, no, Saad sits here, outside. interrupts everybody. Oh, he interrupts his Sam. He interrupts everyone. And the second anyone says something about him, can I finish? Yaki, can I finish? Allow me. Let me land. That's what we're doing out here. Nobody interrupted. Let me land. Is Nobody is like Allow me, Yahi. Nobody is Okay, Sorry. so are we going to speak about how you speak like Billy Ray Cyrus? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Like, we could we could all go we could all go the same way. Anyway, like I was saying, we need to speak about Timo. <laughs> no one was listening, we bro. We need to speak about the fact that Timo Werner. We need to speak about the fact on, that Timo Werner like missed real? an open. No, 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 Billy Ray, no. Billy Ray Cyrus. They're just, they just, Cyrus. the first white guy they could think of. They're like, listen, that's who he looks like to, as racist. Go listen to Old Town Road. Go listen that's to Old Town Road. You'll, you'll see. <laughs> I don't think he's yeah, in that music video. Yeah. 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 Actually, we, I've never Old seen Old Town Road. Billy Ray Cyrus. Abu Miley I got, I got Moon. He's a famous. Moon is on the back. He's a he's a famous country music artist. Remember, oh, we're okay. not in attack. <laughs> da, 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 da. Yeah, yeah. Right in on my horse. My uh, life is a movie. Cardboard. Oh, we need explanation. Technically, I think he was just a producer. Ramadan, Shabab, Ramadan, Ramadan. But we need we need explanation. Yeah, every time, every time we are Ramadan, Ramadan, Ramadan. We need explanations, Jacob. Why? Why? Why did they drop this performance against Fulham? It was shocking. This season they've been shocking. Am I the only one who they... thinks you guys are going over? This season they've been slot. shocking, but but you could only get one point Look on them. Okay. Staffy, the Spurs twerker. No, no, they, no, 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 I, no, 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 no. Let me tell you why. Staffy, let me tell you why. Staffy, let me tell you why. We're not going over. I'm going to tell you why. Hold on, hold on. Let me tell you why we're not going over. I went to all the predictions, Staffy. All of us predicted the Spurs win. Some of us, some of us predicted four one. Jacob, uh, uh, okay, can Jacob. I tell you why? You you I, I did. Just, I it was the, the other way around. <laughs> Even I predicted the Spurs win. These scumbags. We all did. We all did. Everyone did. What is going on? This, hey, this the is what day. happens sometimes, you know, bro. Uh, and two sad, years ago, funny. I think we beat Manchester City, and then the following match we lost to Burnley, and then they got relegated. So these things happen. Okay, can I tell you why? I think you're going to go United, though. I it's just want to say I one think sentence. the most important thing is bottling top five, not making Champions League. That is this is this is this is. I'm not a lie. Villa is probably gonna bottle. I'm not gonna lie to you. I feel like lie. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I don't know. Yes, I lo- but let me I tell you think something. United are gonna get fifth spot. Don't. Yeah, mm. like I feel like Villa is gonna go on such a shit run, and they'll make it. Make it a. a, yeah. a Villa are nine seven, points ahead of uh, you. I don't think. Yeah, no one's watching Orange points. is the New Black. Okay, I know that. I, ten games, Mo. Ten games. Can I just say one thing to Belly Dancer? Belly Dancer. I don't think we will, but I think they'll make it a conversation. It's going to get close enough for people. Staffy Abdo, let me just say one thing. First of all, first of all. All six of us, all six of us, all six of us predicted a Spurs win. Of course. I said we're going to go away. I'm just going to say one sentence. One sentence. And then they go away to Fulham, they lose 3 0. And then your first sentence is I think we're going overboard. Can you stop? Okay. And I'll tell you what. Well, I'll tell you why. I will lie. Okay. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. You stick your ass. Well, I'll Ramadan. tell you why. First of all, well, you I guys, yeah, listen. First of all, shout out to 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 Fulham, the biggest uh, club uh, in, in in West London. You, they <laughs> okay. wish, bro. Fulham. Yeah. I actually, I, I'll tell you what, Hussein. If you go back to all my predictions when we speak about Fulham, I want you to look how many times that I predict Fulham to lose. I actually rate Fulham a lot higher than you guys do. I think they're a good team. And they've been doing well. 
Now, should they be beating Spurs? Probably not. That's not what I'm trying to say. The reason I'm saying you're going overboard is because when you listen to what Sad is saying, oh, what happened to Madison? What happened to me? I don't know. And he's just start naming players that we usually rate and they just had a bad game. I would rather talk about Dragusin not looking good in a back four versus looking good in a back three before he came to Spurs. I would rather talk about Romero not necessarily being a bad defender, but not looking comfortable without Van de Ven. These are the conversations I want to have, Sad. We can we can joke about uh, about uh, Werner and them, and Jacob 100% should hold that because this guy said, to, to, what, what do you used to call him? Uh, Timo, Timo Turber? Timo, 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 Timo No, no, he Timo. told me Timo Turbo Werner. Timo Turbo Werner. Yeah, bro. when he went to Old Trafford and got, a, got an assist. He was, yeah. turbo, he was, turbo, he was turbo when he was trying to kick that ball into the... Did ball. you not see him in front of goal? Oh, Remember when Mo went off on his watch along last week? He was like, what was that? He was like, Bram, what are you going to score? That was that was Jacob watching Werner. He's like, Werner, what are you going to score? Because that's the absolute way he did. He just I did. I did lose center. my shit at that moment because what you saw there was an Ainge masterclass yet again. When we're not playing well, he sets us up into a way that we create chances that all you got to do, just Timo, just tap it in. Brennan Johnson, just tap it. Just redirect. The simplest thing you could yeah, do but, is a but you were as a three, fucking goalkeeper you, you could do that. down at that point. That's my point. I don't that's care. Okay. I don't care. A goal, a goal changes everything and what, no, no matter no, no, what no. the score line is. I'll tell you why you should care because, listen, scoring a constellation at 3-0 it's not a consolation, bro. There was there was three missed three Holy big missed chances God. before we Make, went down three 0 So you making it three one? Bro, you had like, one shot on target before you went three 0 down. One shot. But that's I what I'm trying to say. Big chances like, missed, didn't I? One. Did I say on target or did I say missed, Mo? Big up, big up, Angebo. <laughs> Listen, all I want to say is I actually rate Fulham. They <laughs> went, and, they man. went, they went to a tough ground, in my opinion. They have Munoz, who has five I goals. I've thought in his about last it, game. bro. Fulham Listen, got four points off the uh, league leaders, let me and he's over here laughing like a yeah. Frog. They just beat us, and I saw them beat us. Listen, they yeah. they, 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 they have me for the FA Cup earlier on, and we I knocked are top of the league. league. Yeah, we are top of the league. Allah, you guys are such an unserious. Oh fuck it, shit. Say you are fucking Listen, shit. Listen, Munoz, five goals in his last game. Don't The, the Don't guys have in, some respect. The guys in good form. The guys in good form. Pereira has been good. William, let's talk about William. It's it's crazy how William is what thirty five, and he looks amazing. William, what's a fake Brazilian? Is. I ain't hearing no William prop. He's Respect fake. William. What's this, guy, from Ecuador. this guy, William, he's from Ecuador. <laughs> Respect William, because I'll tell you what, really, William was running. He was the best winger on the pitch. I'm sorry, he was the best winger on the pitch <laughs> yesterday. He was better than any winger Spurs had yesterday. This guy was absolutely running all over the place. If you really are being honest I about it, Wobi was better. Out of the two, uh, yeah. I hear I was gonna say, I think that Wobie second goal will be juke Destiny Udogi and then laid it on Wobie a Wobie had a good game too. But yeah. I just like William because, especially of his age, like this guy's 35 and he's younger, he's running like at a, at, a, at a like he's looking younger than most of these players out there. But, anyways, I'm just going to praise Fulham because they've actually been well, they actually have a decent team. And I'm, I'm gonna be honest, they kept absorbing the pressure by you guys. And they always hit you guys on that left-hand side. That left-hand side was open for them the whole game. What's the name of that left-back? Robinson? I forgot his first name. Every Anthony time, Robinson. He's an Anthony American. Robinson. So he's so Bro, he, he's... Player of the I match. would literally... Player of the match like, I would actually take him at United because we need a left-back next year. He yeah, would be in, in my... He was in. He would be in my list. Of list to play. If we have a list of left-backs we're looking at for next season, he would be on this list. Because You're every actually time, looking at him. Well, there you go. And anyone then. in England who doesn't rate Anthony Robinson, him and Tim Ream locked up England in the yeah, World Cup. Yeah, a lot Cup, of teams so. are looking at him. Not and, and, and remember, Everyone remember, uh, Jacob, since Hold obviously you pay attention to the game more since you're a Spurs fan, he created a chance to Munoz when he tried to back heel it first, and yeah. he didn't get the <laughs> match. Remember? It. Yeah. That could have been an yeah. earlier assist. That's what I'm saying. Fulham actually played a good game. Act Fulham are a decent team. Fulham is this... You know how every year we have this one team that goes from a bottom bottom of the barrel to kind of flirting with with the top half of the table that's fulham for that this year for me should they be beating you three no because you should be doing better but you actually lost to a decent team so how are we going the, over the top then i'm not going over the yeah, top no, in I terms of can okay. you explain to us yeah, so, so, honestly so, that's so, gonna make no sense because so sad is Spurs win. No, no, no forget. Sad, I want to so, so over the board. I think all six of us predicted a Liverpool win as well, Hassan, oh, to hold that. Up. Except for sad. The yeah, but I never, yeah, but I never said that you guys are going over the top for for the cooking. No, no, no. Okay, you guys. Yeah, when I say you're going over, to be honest, Hassan, he said we he threw out the game. Like, okay, I'll tell you why it's overboard. If they lose and Angie's shit, Madison's shit, Romero's shit, 
with so much shit and everyone is shit. That's going overboard. Criticize the game, yes, because I understand they played bad. I think yeah, Madison was Saad horrible. He's talking about the game. No, but that's not what Sad does. Sad is like, oh, because I tell you what, they love to do that with me as well. Yesterday, I, 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 I be sitting. Well, life, I'm in the bro. Well, life, I'm in the I'm just watching a game. Stuff is Basuma still better than Rice. Yeah, why do we have to have this conversation every time they lose? Do I have this because conversation? Noah, because because, 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 because we don't, bro. Because Rice doesn't drop stinkers. Fans, that's why. Rice, calm. Rice doesn't drop stinkers. Because Saad and all our stuff. Yeah, I'm a man. Basuma has dropped. Basuma has dropped stinkers. So please, Sad, let's, Basuma let's has been dropping stinkers. hundred yeah. percent. Listen, have listen, listen. hundred percent. Sad, I can't have more respects than to say that I would take Rice in my team. I don't know what more respect do you want. I said this on the terrace. I said I rate Basuma as a six more. But I would take Rice because I rate him as a as a box to box. I can't say this every time. I'm tired of repeating the same thing. If people ask me again, I'm just gonna say go watch uh, episode 69 of El Ahwa and you'll find the answer there because I'm tired of saying the same thing every time. Anyways, they've had stinkers. Don't get me wrong. But also when you look at it, Arsenal are in a better shape than 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 Spurs. They're further in their quote unquote the word I don't like it but process than Spurs. So they're going to be less vulnerable to mistakes. This Spurs team, I think they need to have humbling losses like this in their quest of be becoming the team that Ange wants. I still have my question marks over Ange, and you guys heard me say this a million times, especially Jacob, and he got pissed. That was the one time he said, what does a YouTuber know versus a manager? I think he still has an, a, an issue with adaptability. That's the biggest issue I have with Ange. But that's something that we will visit again down the line. A loss like this to an away end, uh, like like Fulham is something that you need in your what people say these are growing pains. I don't doubt what Ange is trying to do with this team, and I think he will eventually succeed and make him a good team. I don't know how good would it will they be, but you got to understand that they still have a lot of uh, deadwood in this team that won't be here next year. They won't have a team of Werner missing sitters. They won't have I don't know like who was out. The, 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 well, the, the thing is no no, but Staffy, this where I will this where I you are completely wrong because I tell you what, what exactly. The reason, okay, I'll tell you what. Spurs won't be successful not because of Ainge, because of Levy, because he has consistently let Spurs down. Ainge is cooking now, so I'll give you an example. They can afford, and I know even Jacob himself might disagree with me, but they can afford having a Brennan Johnson in the team if they have Kane and Son next to Brennan Johnson, because then you can hide his deficiencies a bit more. But if you've got Brennan Johnson, you've got Richarlison, and you've got Timo Werner, that is something that not even Klopp can hide. Not even Pep can. By the way, can I go overboard on something since you said mentioned Brennan Johnson? What? This guy's 50 million. We had Daniel James two seasons ago, 15 million. Wallahi, I would take Daniel. Same exact. Wallahi, I would take the same exact. Respect Daniel no, James. Daniel James is better than him. No, 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 no. Wallahi, I'm not joking. Dad, he accused us of going overboard. Now, listen. You think hmm. Brennan Johnson is better than Daniel James? Well, I, 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 think, I would take I, I, Daniel I James think, any you know, day you know, in the week in my team. Johnson, I actually think Brandon Johnson is not even that bad. What honestly. does he do? If I, okay, okay so I, let me ask you something. What is Brandon, Brandon Johnson, Johnson is always involved in the attacks. Brandon Johnson has incredible pace. And Brennan Johnson he's not is faster good than player. Daniel James, but continue. Uh, he's, he's what, very, what he's I would, the, the thing I would say about Brandon Johnson is if you want to see what he can do well, I, the first time I've seen a really good game like his best game for me was last week versus Aston Villa this week was a complete opposite he wasn't even our worst player but he was ass cheeks I don't know what like I do think he's better than Daniel James however because Daniel James doesn't even not. start yeah. for Leeds United so Daniel James crazy. what he done for United is better than anything uh, Daniel, uh, what's his name Brandon Johnson is giving it this year I swear if you would have had Daniel James of three years ago in your team he would be he would be better than this Brandon Johnson I rate all the signings Inge did except for this one so people will accuse me of twerking here you go I'm not twerking for him I'm actually criticizing him 50 million for this guy who just runs I'm not gonna lie. That's shocking. That's shocking investment in this team because he's gonna uh, be I another one. Like you know how we're looking at Anthony that we're not gonna need to get rid of him and reinvest again because we failed. Now, now you're now right you're going overboard. Yeah, you're listen, listen to me. 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 Is the crazy? Brandon thing I've Johnson ever heard. just needs. It's not crazy. In here. It's not crazy. Stuffy comes bro. in here and says, "Oh, Fulham are a great team. Oh, this. Oh, that." I didn't say that. they spent ten times the amount Fulham spent. They spent that, ten lie. times the amount Fulham spend. What does money mean? What does money mean? What does money mean the in the game? Fulham spend. Okay, it so why don't matter. I win the league? You sad. can buy better players. Why don't I win the league? Bro, sad when I players, spend more than you. The players that the players that they <laughs> bought, yeah, Cooked. is one of my one of my rejects. One of my rejects in Willian went up against them and bossed them. 
So how can, can they buy these? How can they? Master, how can Master they buy you're reject. How, how Master, can you're they reject. buy one of? Have some respect, how can bro. they buy? Brother, we let him off. Respect, he got, he got, he, bro, he got left. He bro, he, he left his money. He said it. He, he said came there for money, off. man. He used we you for money. Signed him off. He used you for off. money, bro. Okay, he used firstly, you for money. Ziad, Ziad, as Chelsea man. fan, I do not want you to be the one that says. What you do you mean? He was. He won trophies. Bro, that, he won trophies at Chelsea. When Enzo, when Enzo Fernandez, when Enzo Fernandez, why are you not obsessed with Enzo Fernandez? Why are you obsessed with Enzo Fernandez? William was one trophies at Chelsea. He didn't fuck all at your club, man. Your club is dead, bro. You're one. One point ahead of Fulham. What are we doing? Relax, sit on the floor. Yeah, respect, now, William. I want to speak about the more, no more club. successful than your club, bro. Why? Why are Fulham? Why are Fulham? Why are Fulham spending? Well, this we are all money? deflecting I... from the real thing with Jacob. Yeah, yeah. 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 When I, when Okay, I, go I, ahead, bro. No, no, what's go ahead, Mo. No, no, go no, ahead, Mo. No, Stuffy was talking to Jacob. Stuffy was talking. Stuffy was talking about Spurs, and now these guys are talking about. Sadly, wants me to sit Chelsea here and say, "Oh and my God!" Because Sad just so Googled how much okay, Spurs spent Let, versus. I'm going to give Google's everyone like, the monologue look, that they want. Here you go, Sad. Sad, I didn't spend. I didn't spend. You know it. You spend. You spend a lot of money. But okay, guys, so, 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 I'm gonna do this. Oh, we don't I'm, spend the money, bro. I'm gonna do this. Money. So everyone in, and money. so you and everyone in the comments can be happy. Spurs are so shit. Fulham don't spend money. Spurs wasted so much money and you lost 3-0 to them. Ha ha ha. You lost to an Arsenal reject. Ha ha ha. Angie's shit. What? Ha ha ha. This is what we are, mate. Is that this it's, is what people want me to say? Because every time I try to be objective what about what games. Oh, this, this guy's waffling. Yeah, this game. We want you to speak about what happened in the game. I spoke what, so happened in the game. You're talking about Madison being. About, a, you want you to speak Madison about how sad. he's overrated these players. He's overrated Ooh, these players. Yes, he's overrated okay, 100%, them. Bro. I agree with you. So speak okay. about it then. Speak okay. about sad, it. Sad, sad, sad. Cry more sad. But sad, this is a different oh, convo, sad. Okay, okay, sad. Hold on. This guy sits here and says, Kuti, Kuti, Kuti. And then Kuti, Kuti, Kuti. Sad, yeah. Kuti, sad this, this is a different bro, convo. Bro, and then just because you think about like, my center back all day don't well, mean that's my well, fault. What are you talking have, about? Well, players sad, can sad, have a strict a, game. Like, sad, they can. Isn't that not the excuse you used for Saliba when he gave the ball away in Porto? Sad. Declan Rice when he gave the ball away in Porto? Sad, sad. Like, listen, Jenny is my boy and everything. But listen, sad. Jacob Level. sits here and says mm. Timo Tur Turbo Werner. Like, I, I, unfortunately, I can't take everything he says seriously because I, at some point I need to know that he's joking about some stuff. Like, there's no way I think he actually rates Werner. Yes, hmm? does he overrate some of his players? Yeah, probably. But you also underrate a lot of his players because you just waited for one loss to say Madison is shit. We were praising him for three months in the beginning of the season and all of us were talking about Madison in conversations with Odegaard, Bruno, game. and KDB. Now we're calling him game. shit. Okay, he was shit, he was shit 100%. Let's talk about why he was shit. Why do you think he was shit, Sad? Consistency. Consistency is needed. His shots were off. Passing was off. He needs... So is it a one-off? Or game. is it he's just been bad for a while? In the game. You have to be consistent to be a top player. Like they speak about him. It's not just Jacob. It's the rest of the Spurs fan base. They're all fucked in the head. They speak about these players like as if they're great. They speak about these players like as if they're, they're, they're holy players that they, they can win anything. I'm hearing people say, I on any day of the week, with my full 11, I can beat anybody in the league. Well, Fulham stopped right in front of you and said, no, you can't. Sad, can I, can I, I don't know. Sad, no, Do we have our full You just dunked on yourself. You didn't have our 11. What are you talking about? Jacob, 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 there's something I want to stop sad. I will not cook Jacob for other Spurs fans' stakes. Same way I'll not cook you for what Egal said. I don't give a fuck what other fraudulent. No, no, of course, of hear course. Me out, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. But here he hear goes. Me out, hear me out. But Jacob one has way was hard, it's always one way or the other. Right. Guys, guys, yeah. let me speak before this gets so, messy. Don't act like Jacob is objective, if, if bro. Jay, okay, said no, no, stuff, yeah, bro. let me breathe. Yeah. Let let me breathe. breathe. Halas, halas. Okay, Romero, Romero, I agree with you. But all of us have acknowledged that we all think Jacob overrates Romero. I agree with you. But the statement that you just said is other statements just... that other players find have said. Okay, Saad, I'll ask you one simple question. Do you believe nine Arsenal players get in an Arsenal Madrid combined 11? No. Okay, I, man, that's uh, what an Arsenal fan said. So I don't okay. care what other Spurs fans say. You're I'm fine. holding Jacob accountable for overrating the fuck out of Romero. Agreed. No problem. For him saying they're going to slap the fuck out of Fulham, agreed, no problem. For him overrating some of his players, agreed, no problem. For him saying I need to be a Sky pundit to criticize that. age, no problem. But some of this crazy shit, I didn't, didn't Okay, say, don't lie. No, no, Hussam, don't lie. Y'all are obviously misconstruing what I said in that moment because you didn't like what I fucking said. All right? What I said was when it comes to the opinions of a guy on YouTube or six fuckers on YouTube versus a manager who's managed at the top level, I'm going to take this. 
If I have a YouTuber versus a guy who has a salary. Have? How many subs does Ainge have? <laughs> <laughs> Hold that, Ainge. I got more subs than Hold you. That, shit. Hey, hey, that's true. I can't, I can't refute that. Max, on your head top, Ainge. Listen, on that note, let me just read the super chat so we can just wrap it up. Wait, can I ask you? Uh, no, no, I want to ask Jacob one last question, please. Father. And it's a real one. Like, not, not even try to be shameless or something. Do you think Sorry. Van de Veen is your most important defender? I know you love Kuti, but I, I I think you would equally love all your players. Do you think Van de Veen is your most I think important if... defender? Look at Mo, look at Mo, he loves that question. <laughs> He's like, yo, stop, he's been learning off me. The devil's advocate. <laughs> I think the most important thing it's to no any right center back here, Jacob, just to let you know. <laughs> You're losing either way. There is no right to answer. I can't lie. Stop it. That's a good question. There is a correct way to answer, and I have my answer. There is a correct way. If I may, or do I got to be Go like Saad and be like, can I speak? Let me land. You're not a fucking airplane, by the way. Okay? <laughs> Man acts like he's a helicopter. Can I land? Oh, I've never can seen somebody so sensitive. This guy. Why are you sensitive? Yeah. I'm trying to, to talk, Saad. Please, please don't interrupt me. Oh, please don't interrupt me. Oh, please don't interrupt me. Wait, wait. Oh, my. Oh, my. Now to sit and talk like this. Bro, land your point, bro. Stop bitching and land your point. Okay, come on. Come on. Let him speak. Let him speak. Come on. Let him speak. Let him speak. You asked him a question. He's talking about sad. Go ahead, Jacob. He I'm good. He I'm good. Answer. Why? I asked you a question. Forget I'm sad, bro. No, 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 forget sad. See what you. No, did, it's sad. it's more about this guy bitches and cries on air, off air about fucking. Don't interrupt me. Then he interrupts me every time I start talking. But here we are. But since we're on air, oh, Jacob can't say that. No, don't be mean on air, Jacob. <laughs> but this guy is the most fucking. Uh, and then you look at his face and he just smile. Well, I ignore him. Well, I ignore him. I was the one talking, not him. <laughs> let me, let me, let, let me just read the super chat so we can wrap up. Khalas, this is pointless. No. Good job. Good job, sad. Good fucking job, sad. We almost got an answer if he rates Vandevin more than Kuti Romero. Quickly. And, and okay, you ruined Jacob. It. Okay, one second, guys. Tune into the next El Aqua, and you might Everyone find out. You, Jacob. Is Van de Ven your best, most important defender? I think the most important thing to any defender is chemistry with your compadres. When you throw in Dragusin, who hasn't had one Premier League start in his entire career, it's going to look like that, I think. So uh, Van de Ven and Romero weren't perfect together the first time that they played together. So that's just one of those things that happens. It's a natural ebb and flow of having injuries and having other people take in that spot. Obviously, Dragusin is not the same uh profile of defender is van Deveen. he doesn't have that space he or the, excuse me he doesn't have that pace he doesn't have the ability to be that last lying man and even when we rely on him as that last lying man it showed that he was unable to do that and i think from a romero standpoint it was trying to lead a line that necessarily pedro Porra wasn't giving him any help either and that's been a motto that's been a re reoccurring theme for quite some time that Pedro Poro is very much lacking defensively. Uh, but honestly, I didn't think Romero was the worst one out of the back line, but I get it. He's top dog. And when you're at the top, all the other dogs got to bark up and look at you. So I understand that's why I saw it. And everyone else who wants to talk this about Kuti Romero, why you don't like it. Perfect answer. So put that and then we end. Can I talk? Big up Mo, 18K we move. Come on you Spurs, sad is a fraud. Big up Mo. Inshallah, 20k okay. soon. Big up to you, Mr. Khan. Big up to Registica who says, Jacob, you absolute fraud. Hold that. Kev is back. Man, like Regista, my favorite player on the staff TV team. Uh, ZD says, if Arsenal do he's a double, we are finished. I said he's fired from the team. Just let him know that. He can hold, you can hold that. Then your team sucks. Uh, if Arsenal do a double, we are finished. Summer fires for real. I'll be honest with you. Me personally, if Arsenal win the league, I'll congratulate them. I'm not going to cry about it. Big up to you, ZDT. Big up to Daniel Proper Chels. Fulham is North London's daddy. Both Arsenal and Tottenham lost to Everyone them. Everyone is going to say this daddy thing now. <laughs> yeah, it's the new thing, thing now. You know, you know, my watch along, my Liverpool Man United watch along. 18 comments. Who's your daddy? A wallet. Who's your daddy? Yeah, told, who's your daddy? I told, I told them to spam that. You're welcome. I'm like, bro. La, la, I'm not talking about the live chat. I'm talking about the comments after the stream ended. You know, like, the yeah, I told them go there and, and let them know who's your daddy. I'm like, yeah, this is Mo's thing, not mine. La, la, Mo, I'm can you get wallet. a merch with that? I just want your picture. Uh, oh, on my the, God. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? Can I get a pick up to you, Daniel? Um, 
Big up to Hormuz says, Kutti in my language means bitch. Hold that, Jacob. That's actually factually true. In Urdu, it is. Kutti. Kutta, kutta means Fima, dog. You're, you're in Canada. Means... You don't get much sun out there. You get snow. So hold that. I'm over here basking <laughs> in the sun every single day. Oh, you're over there lacing mean, up. Oh, how many layers today? Because I'm in fucking Canada. Yeah, I keep wearing jackets, you fraud. Are you this invader? Yeah, he can hold that too. Yeah, Vader can hold that. I'm with him. He can absolutely. He's a fraud. He is the biggest. Oh, we're underdogs. He's just like Hamza. Every city fan, we're underdogs. Oh, Hamza in the north. We need to replace our attack. Not gonna lie. Uh, Kulu, Werner, Richarlison. I, I, I agree. That's one of the points I'm making earlier on. <laughs> I think, me personally, this is just my opinion from the outside looking. I could be wrong. Even Spurs fan might disagree with me. I don't necessarily think Johnson is that bad. He just needs two good players around him so he could cook. So he could get better. That's my honest opinion. But I could be wrong. Um, I agree with that super chat. Those three names are not good enough wingers, in my opinion. Yes. See how I can be objective? Um, this is all your fault, Hussam, and all the arrogant pricks who can't take one game at a time. I told you the other day, humble yourself. Now this happens. Andrew, are you sure you're not confusing me with someone else? Are you calling <laughs> the same guy who said this game, I think, is going to be a tough game? Actually, Hussam, I don't think we're Hussam, win it. In cor with correction... Yeah. He spelt he spelt your name wrong, so he might be talking about someone else. He said Hussein. Yes. <laughs> I hope Who's Hussein, bro? <laughs> By definition, this cannot be me because I was the one guy who was not going like, oh my god, we're gonna smash Man United. That was the one guy. It was not me, brother. Go watch the straight facts on the terrace with me and Staffy. Go watch the previews. Go watch the back again podcast on Friday, bro. You, I think you got the wrong guy. Kuti, kuti, kuti. Can't you see, Jacob? No, I can't. Big up to you, Red Line Taranga. That's my guy right there, Usman. Shout out to the, to the, the Senegalese lion in the chat. And finally... Hey, well, my center back's outscoring some of y'all's forwards. <laughs> we'll come be my club. Big up to Hype, who says, thoughts on troops choosing content over Arsenal. I don't know what you mean, but big up to my guy, troops. Shout out to him regardless. You get me one of the OGs, one of the goats of, of YouTube. Big up to him. Big up to all of you guys. We are ending the stream on 1,300 people. We had 2,000... 100 people in here at some point in time you guys were here for the Liverpool downfall but hey ho make sure you guys are hitting the like button make sure you guys are subscribing to this is football right here right now every single one of you guys on your way out please slap the like button please subscribe to this is football all these guys before jacob shames me in the private chat all these guys' channels is actually in the description. I just double check. So all of these guys' channels is in the description. United Spurs of America, go subscribe. Me and Jacob took our cooking like a champion. Footy Judgment, go subscribe. Ziad Zone, go subscribe. The Football Corner Night 7, go subscribe. Staffy TV, go subscribe. Subscribe to all these great guys. Love you all. Hit the like button on, on your way out. Um, and we're going to be back tomorrow probably with a show with Tom Little or some shit. So I have no idea what I'm doing. But I do have you entertained during this international break, Habibis. Peace.